Even though I sucked, I was really bad. It's like delusion. I think that delusion sometimes gets you really far. Who hurt you? Right. I can't talk to men about it. Women have the best advice. Yeah. You're gonna be like a totally different but woman when you're free, you know. Have you Ooh. fake cried before? Yes, ma'am. How many blessings do you think you missed out on? <laughs> no, you, are, you God doesn't know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All the other dudes, like they just want me too much, and I just feel like mm. if you want me that bad, yeah, I feel like I'm doing charity work by letting you. Hey, no, no, no. hey, she fits, she was, it's your own shoe. Hot like I lie. Yeah, but I'm honest about it. I was, so you guys listen to the music, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. And just off the last song, just titled Sex, right? <laughs> <laughs> and then you dive deeper and it's got all of this toxicity. It made me just think of when I was 20 something and wild in the outside. streets. <laughs> <laughs> So you're not toxic anymore? No, I changed. I'm engaged. What age did you change? Oof. Apparently. You have to think about this now. 20, 2019 <laughs> is the year I changed. Whatever <laughs> age I was that year, that's when is I that changed. Is that when you met? met? Yes, ma'am. Okay, cool. So is, did meeting her make you change? Um... Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I was gonna yeah. say, <laughs> obviously, what else? yeah. I'm saying like you could have done something really bad. I don't know. Oh no, I did yeah. horrible things before um, that, <laughs> um, and it 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 did make me think. Yeah, I should change. Then but I didn't it, change, yeah. and then I changed because there was one that I was thinking of where I was in a crazy situation. And I'm thinking how to, I need to admit some things, mm -hmm. but I do want to tell it because it's funny. Like yeah, I remember us. the night before whole crazy situation, I went through her phone. She went through my phone. Like I planted some shit in mine. What do you what? mean planted? You mean? Like I, it's so hard to explain. It's like a, ooh, half. This an, sounds mad toxic already. It was, man. it was amazing yeah, though. Yeah. Like I had so much fun doing it. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, I planted this shit in my phone. Knowing that, like, when I do what I do, she's gonna want to look back, and I'll like willingly hand it over, like, look at because she had suspicions that I was doing something with someone that she didn't want me to. Mm -hmm. So I did that shit. Oh, oh, you actually did it with the person that she. Did yeah. With. So then I before the suspicions. Or like you knew she was suspicious, then you before, did it. Before the suspicion. Oh, so, oh, so you right. were doing it. Yeah. 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 You yeah. made it seem like you retaliated. Right. No, it wasn't retaliation. It was like, Foresight, I have foresight oh, that so I needed to do this. That she was gonna think you were doing it, so you did it. Yeah. What kind of evil genius <gasps> is this? Crazy. Right? <laughs> uh, uh. <laughs> so I did that shit, but like, I'm gonna miss out, bear the story. But fast forward, so the night of boom, gone for each other's things, hor horrible decisions that night, still stayed the night, boom, boom, boom. Then in the next morning, she's dropping me to work and hit me with, like, do you still love her? And in my head, I was thinking, I was just thinking, innit? <laughs> <laughs> so I didn't say nothing, but that's not good in that situation. Yeah, like, I'm supposed to say no, innit? No, you're supposed to say yes. She... No, not no. her, the other person. Oh. So, oh. so the person who was in the phone. Yeah. You, she she was dropping you, you to no, work. No, the person that's dropping me to work asks if I still love the person in the phone. Oh. oh. And I didn't answer. So obviously it seems like a yes, isn't it? That is a yes. Kick me out of the car immediately. Well, you already at oh, work. Oh, she asked you in person? No, I wasn't at work. I was like halfway. Oh, <laughs> man. Yeah, she asked me. I was in the passenger, kicked me right out of that place. You didn't even want to get a full lift to work. <laughs> yeah, <I> was, <laughs> she, <laughs> that's why you tried to pause. You're trying to get further. Yeah, yeah. yeah. To work. <laughs> uh, get me a little. <laughs> huh? <laughs> me? Because you're like, that's fucked up. It's oh, fucked up. Really? The story's worse, man. There's so much foolishness that happened in that. But... It, the listening that's the problem because listening to what you were singing about made me just like toxic times I don't believe that you're not toxic anymore after that oh, no, I, I feel changed. like that takes years to kind of like drain <laughs> it's out a boss. like there's no way no, that but remember what I said I knew my character that I could change when I want to like yeah. I knew when I needed to change mm. Mm. I just didn't want to so when it was time it was an easy transition <laughs> he said bullshit Niggas made you feel like, like Oh that's some bullshit He said you feel like The best part of like 20 minutes And he said that's bullshit I do, I do you want What the bullshit <laughs> She even said nah That needs years to come out Nah I hear that So what You lot ain't never been I've never ah. been toxic 
I don't think I've ever How been toxic, you? you know. 30. Are you? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. Yeah, I don't think I've ever been toxic, especially Not to, to that, that degree. extent. Do you are married? I'm engaged, yeah. I'm married. Oh my god! I know. Yeah. Is, 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 is this what you wanted? <laughs> is marriage is that what you wanted? Like? But I feel like thirty is young. I know a lot of people that are like Nicole. way older than that, and they're still not married. Like a mm. lot. Oh yeah, I, but but is that like an American thing? Or hundred like, percent. Oh, okay. You guys are in the club for way too long. <laughs> <laughs> way yeah. too long. Like crazy. if you think about even like some of these artists are like forty. Like mm. five, yeah, forty-five, True. late forties, yeah. and they're still in there. Maybe because they got their youth, because they're in music and stuff. But you think about mm-hmm. it, like dudes in the strip club throwing ones, and he's like exactly. forty-eight. That's crazy. <laughs> Strippers at eighteen, nineteen, it's crazy. <laughs> like that don't make no sense. That, I don't know how that's attractive, so, but somehow it is in America. Like yeah. America's not real. We actually have said it. It's a simulation. It's not real. It's not a real place. Like, have you been there? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Have you been to LA? No, haven't been to LA. Is That's that where it's the worst. <laughs> LA is not real. Like America, like okay, whatever. But LA is not fucking real at all. What's what's so fake it's about it? Like, like even that, everything that you're saying about America, it's like Times Ten in LA. Oh, is it? Yeah. It's Why funny. does everyone have to move out there if you know that it's so fake? Why don't they move out there? Like, everybody just says, oh, yeah, go to LA. Like, that's the place I mean, where it's going like to happen. I mean, that's like the hub of everything. For me, at least, as a singer. <laughs> True. So have you moved out there? Yeah, or, I live in LA. How long? Four years. Where was you before? Indiana, so some country. But that's down. where people get married at 30. LA, you get married at like... Actually, LA, you don't really get married. You kind of just like have <laughs> 10 girlfriends for the rest of your life. I, I don't know. Where's Indiana? The south? In Midwest. Next to Chicago. Okay. Okay. But right, I don't right, even, right, it's, right. You can't really look. It's hard to figure out. I don't know. No, right. Middle of nowhere. So, yeah. Because yeah. what we usually... This is the 90s, baby, Sean. But you was born... Was it nice? I was born in 2000. Okay. Wow. Have we had the two first Everybody on the show before? Everybody says that. We've had... Wow. Have we? I don't um, know if we have. I think we've had younger. Than 2000? Who'd you have younger? Uh, we ain't had no 20-year-olds in, in time. Think about it. We, we don't... That's right. Because obviously, we just like to see what, what was the difference. Obviously, there's just big differences in mm. UK, US. But yeah. just like understanding your school upbringing, like what was... Mm-hmm. What's a, you got siblings, in fact. Mm-hmm, I have two siblings. And where do you fall? Middle? Middle. What's that like? I just love attention. You love attention? <laughs> you just yeah. want attention. She even kicked what, her legs. Do you as feel well. like you, you weren't getting enough? I don't think I think that there's something special in the old child, then there's like the young one spoiled, so the middle one just kinda gets like coming yeah. into the boat. I feel you. I feel what are you guys? Middle. Youngest. Oh, so why are you asking me what it's like and you know what it's like? No, I just no, wanted I just... to like confirm oh. it without like So you agree? Of course. Yeah. Without because oh, okay. people don't <laughs> believe middle children when they say the shit wasn't easy. Like they just. I mean, it was easy. We just. We wanted more attention. Yeah. The oldest got you know all of the perks. The youngest was spoiled. We just there looking for attention. I don't feel nah, like I was spoiled. Got all the oldest got stressed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. You, you don't think you were spoiled? Nah. Why? Nah. How? I just, I don't feel like I was given any special treatment. I was just the last one. Do you get what I'm saying? <laughs> but I wasn't treated special. No, no. You were, might not have been treated special, but your parents were definitely way more tired when it got to you. So <laughs> the shit that they would have had energy for before, they didn't have the energy okay, for you, yeah, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I get you, I get you, I get you. But uh, did you get hang me down clothes? A few, a few, a few, one or two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. One, two, Prada jacket. A Prada oh, jacket. Good. Yeah, don't know if it was real, but I doubt it. I don't know if it we was still real. lived in the block, bro. <laughs> no, but my brother was hustling though. Oh yeah, yeah at one true. point, so that's maybe true. it might have been real. What's he proud of jacket? I think there was some one tens. There was MX ninety fives. You know MX ninety five. Oh, yeah. Nike. Yeah. One I, two I of those. I remember what's it called? What did I get? I got a couple of jeans and a cap. I remember one time I went on a school trip, and you know New Eras when they came out, the New Era caps. Mm. And um, I just wanted to wear it so badly. The shit did not fit my head, bruv. You know, <laughs> the, when sides. the sides is just. <laughs> 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 but my brother was like, yeah, he doesn't want it. I can have it. I'm out there with the hat. That's like. <laughs> yeah, bro. Anything your older brother had, you, you, you'd be on. But middle. So did you ever look up to your older sibling? Is it o- older? No. no? She's Ooh. crazy. She's she was, crazy. Yeah. She was always sneaking out. She would like party, drink. She was, she bullied the shit out of me. Can I cuss on I can cuss on okay. Yeah. She yeah, was yeah. crazy. She would pull me down the stairs with my hair. She was so mean. Yeah. Oh, back. shit. Huh? Swing back. No, I'll just flip her off. Oh. She'd have like a video camera be like, I'm showing mom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, she was so mean. She tortured me. What's Did the relationship have... now? 
She looks up to me now. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're the shit now. Nah, so you're on Spotify. <laughs> you know what I mean? That's crazy. Like, because I'm thinking, like, when it comes to, like, let's say your siblings, like, did you fight? How was you with your younger one then? If you thought your older oh, one was crazy. Oh, we fought like crazy. So you was the crazy one to her then, right? I think I'm just the crazy one. I think the middle, I don't yeah, know. Yeah, so oh, you're so the common denominator. Denom- denom- <laughs> <laughs> okay. It was you all along. <laughs> I don't know, but I was mean to my little brother. She was mean to me. I was mean to my little brother. So I think it just passes down. Mm, How many so. siblings do you have? Two, but I'm the, I'm the youngest, older brother and sisters in the middle. Okay, so you're just spoiled, basically. What are you? <laughs> I'm, I'm the second youngest. So I've got younger brother, older brother, and an older sister. Okay. Yeah. Interesting. Oh, yeah, but yeah, I'm yeah, the good yeah. one. Ish. <laughs> I am. <laughs> Look true, at true, true, true. Come on. True. Yeah, 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 no, yeah, yeah, yeah. 100%. 100%. <laughs> you're right. did, you, did you not for friends? Like, you know did, like when you, like in your area, <laughs> like for us, it was like, if we wanted to play with our friends, we'd have to go and knock on their door and be like, are you allowed Oh out? yeah, we would do that for like a year or two. A year Actually, or no, two? Was, no, 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 we didn't do that. It's like Instagram. Oh my oh. God. So, so you come out. Life is so different. I mean, but I get that and understand that. But yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that I live like the last few years of that. And then, and then it was just Instagram. Yeah. Damn, that's so different. Because I remember having to go and knock for people to be like, yo, look, do you know what you do, yeah? You knock on the door knowing that they weren't really allowed out. Yeah, or they'd be yeah. outside already. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was that like that. And then their mum would be like, no, he's not coming. Yeah. <laughs> but then you'd have to send like your little brother or somebody cute down yeah. to be like, yeah, now go ask mum if we can go for like 10 minutes. Now. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did that too, didn't it? Like it's a whole experience that your generation. So, it's mad to say your did, generation. Did but. you just have like flat out freedom like growing up, or was there? Many I mean, rules? my family, yeah. But I lived in like the country, not the country, but I would just run. I wouldn't tell my parents anything I did. We would have people over without telling them. We would leave without telling them. Like they, it was just wild. Go outside, but we were still good. We didn't take advantage of it. I guess. What's the country like? Yeah, what, what, it's like, not is even it, is the it cornfields. What's the, what's I mean, Indiana's like? full of cornfields, cornfields, but I wasn't country. I wasn't. I wasn't like on a farm or something. <laughs> yeah, <like that. laughs> but it was fun. We we just ran around outside. I mean, the way you said before Instagram, you go to your neighbor's house and knock on their door. That's kind of like what it was. But now you can just DM them and be like, "I'm, well, I'm gonna meet you here right now," and then they'll go. But I don't know. It's a lot of freedom. So you, what about London? <laughs> Man, just got, you can't just walk outside. That's crazy. Okay, I guess I am country. Then. <laughs> they might not be there. Like, <laughs> you have to organize this properly. There was even a point where, like, you didn't have a phone, so you just had to go to the place that you hoped that everybody was, mm-hmm. and just hope that they were there. If they weren't there, then yeah, yeah. Right. I feel like I'm talking to like 50 year olds right now. So it's like, like this that. is like a nine like year di- or eight year difference. It's yeah. different. We, I'd have to go to three different locations, and if they weren't there, I don't know where they are. We, me and my brothers, learned to tell tell the time by our shadow. What? what? I'm telling you, I know. bro. You're you're mad. Mad. You're mad. You're mad. You know what? He's making us sound mad right yeah. now. We're not all like this, nah, London, for I, sure. That's crazy. I knew what time it was when I need to go home. Where's my shadow? It's like it's this time. is caveman era that you're talking about. Because of the street lights. So when the street lights come on, yeah. Hey, yeah. don't let me. <laughs> <laughs> I know, honestly. To come out, go home. Like, yeah, we knew when it was free. Face north. Where's your shadow? Let's go. He said, Face north. How do you know where you north, north is, bro? Oh my yeah, how how you know where north, north, north is, north is, is bro. Know where north was. You had That's a compass impossible. in your pocket, man. <laughs> There's no way you knew where North Why is. Why can't I know where North is? What you just that? didn't. I, you know, <laughs> Columbus and yeah, It was my brother. My brother taught me this shit. What How did you doing? know the time was right though? Like when you got in, was it exactly? I didn't get what you beat said? when I got there. <laughs> 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 he said close enough. I <laughs> we good. No beat is cool. Yeah, we got time. We got time. Yeah, yeah, that's it. <laughs> that, that's three o'clock. Cool. Let's go. When my shadows there, that's the time to go. That's it. That's how it what was. What about discipline then? Like, cause what? I don't know how it is country wise. Mm-hmm. Hey, obviously, you know, people might get beats. Yeah. Belt, different weapons. My mom had a spoon. It was like a big ass. Okay, spoon. Really? Wooden. It was a wooden spoon. She was like, I'm getting the fucking wooden spoon. You got the metal. I didn't get a metal, metal one. one. But the wooden one's bad because that's splinters, like all that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, have you ever got splinters from it? I don't know, but it's just wooden. I mean, yeah, 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 yeah. Spoon, that's mad. So I guess not because you're eating from it. But I had a spoon. I'm like, people, when I say that, like, you're fucking weird, but. 
It nah, was a spoon. That's, I can't that's believe you had a spoon too. I had a spoon. I had the wiffle bat. I had oh, the, the wiffle, wiffle bat. bat. You know how the yellow, the yellow. You remember? You oh, remember? oh, I've oh, seen yeah, it on TV. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. I've seen it on TV. Shit mm. so what, like what kind of games do you not play in school? Like, did you play dodgeball? Oh my god, most definitely. I feel like a twelve-year-old or something. Um, <laughs> I don't really know. Did you played dodgeball as a kid. I played cops and robbers. That was my favorite game. Oh really? What yeah. were you, the cop or the robber? Kind of both. But we, we would. I live in the middle of the woods, so we play like scary music on a speaker Ooh, outside. That must have been lit. And it would be like the middle of the night, and all my friends. We had like walkie talkies. It was so fun. That's I hard. miss it so much. Those are like the best days ever. What about you guys? Football. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, young runouts, 40 40 home. Yeah, but those games, you, you don't know clue nah, what you're yeah. talking about. <laughs> yeah, I don't but, know. Yeah. The woods thing is live, but. I'd be scared, but I get you live there, so like that's my woods, isn't it? Mm. My man can't play. What? Nah, woods. impossible. That sounds like a horror movie. Like that's where you don't go. Like that's where everyone dies. Oh, I know. My friends hated my house. Well, I had the popular house, but it was the most terrifying thing ever. But yeah. yeah. I don't know. I'm good right now. Yeah, I made it. <laughs> you made it. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I think I just moved. The fake it. LA okay. land. So how was yeah. it in comparison to now? You're in a city, city though. Mm-hmm. Do you know what I mean? Was that hard to adjust it? No, but I think that I kind of, my later teenage years, and now I'm 22, that era of my life and growing was spent in LA. And I just got introduced to so much toxic shit. Mm. So I think that it kind of just like, it was a few years of like, what the fuck? Mm. Like dating in LA is completely different. Just so much stuff is different that I had to kind of adjust to. And I I moved there and didn't know anybody. So I I kind of built a community, but I don't know. It was really hard. Did you move there like already with like a deal in place or did you just move yeah, there to signed. try and make it? Yeah, I got signed. Okay. Yeah. Uh, to Rock Nation? Or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so. When I was 18, I got signed and moved immediately within like a month or two. Right. So you've been on Rock Nation since? Since then, yeah. Okay, that's cool. Mm-hmm. So when you went there, obviously you've been signed. Mm-hmm. Tell us of that journey. Like, how did that happen? Like, I was just before recording. Before you even got there. Oh, before I got signed? Before you got signed. I yeah. was just doing Instagram covers like every day. Oh, there's that whole period, isn't it? Where people yeah. were just doing covers. It's horrible. I would never go back. <laughs> Ever. <laughs> it's but I do like singing covers, but if some people get stuck there. I'm so glad that I got out of that. But I was just doing covers. And then Omar from Rock Nation heard a cover, flew to Indiana and had dinner with me. And then I saw me a few weeks later. Whoa. That's and cold. Yeah. <laughs> what song was it? A Best Part by Her and Daniel Caesar. Yeah, that was a banger. That was a banger. Okay, yeah, yeah, that was a good song. So, I'm not <laughs> going to. I was going to, but I was going to embarrass myself. So let me just... <laughs> I, I do like that song. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so when you stopped doing covers, when did you... do? How do you, Why did you decide, in fact, that it's toxic music that I'm going to... Because tox- that's my life. <laughs> that's what I'm going through. Tell I don't want to be toxic. I'm tired of being like the toxic R&B girl, but that's just what I became. But I'm living my truth. <laughs> <laughs> so, is, so you acknowledge that in the relationships it was you being toxic? No, or was it was it a him. joint effort? It was him, but I learned... As I said, I was developing the pa- like those older teenage years, starting to... I mean starting to really date, have sex, all that shit. Like, that was in LA, so it's toxic. So I'm learning from toxic, pe- toxic people, I mm. think. Yeah. I think that I literally learned from the people that are doing shit to me. And it's like, okay, that's how you do it. So I kind of just developed those same toxic tendencies. But not as bad as you. Because whatever you said earlier... <laughs> yeah, that was crazy. That was crazy. <laughs> like, that blew my mind. That was crazy, bro. That's so that was crazy. That's that, going to be our next hit. Yeah. All right. <laughs> 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 I'm trying crazy. to rethink so all my talks. When you when you got to LA, mm-hmm. you're by yourself. Mm-hmm. How do you go about making friends? Because a, a lot of people that come here, they tell us, yeah, when you go LA, you go to the coffee shop, and then boom, you meet make no. friends like that. It's Everybody like there is a weirdo. I was making friends <laughs> in the studio, but I was I couldn't drink yet, so I, w- I wasn't really doing oh. shit. So it was a few years of me being a lot alone a lot. But now I have a lot of friends. Because of the I party club. a lot. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, kind of. You work with people, you meet people. Like, it takes a few years, but, you know. But I never I never purposely was like, I'm going to make friends tonight. Oh, you didn't go to the no. club? No. Like, yeah, I'm going to find the bestie today. Yeah, like, <laughs> no. Just hit the toilets. Yeah, the word, like, no. The word, yeah, 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 yeah. Girls, are different. Girls are hella crazy. friendly in the toilets. Yeah. That's how they, they were taking 10 minutes. I'm thinking, bro, she's doing the shit. 
But yeah. Come on, she's got a bestie, bro. <laughs> Bad but pictures. I guess it work. <laughs> Hella selfies in that. Yeah. So, all right, what's a what's a um a story you haven't written yet? Is it writ written? Written. Wrote. Written. That's crazy. <laughs> wrote is the mad, words? bro. Written. Like some like a <laughs> wrote. Pen. Just in something not toxic. I want to fall in love. That's what I want to sing about, but I haven't fallen in love yet. Damn. Have you got what? an eye on anybody? Yeah, but they're toxic. You didn't even have like a childhood love, like childhood sweetheart. No, I was a weirdo. I was such a loner. Because yeah. I've always been that way, but I always felt like I was just like a bitch or something. I don't know. Mm, yeah, because... You still could be. <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, maybe... It's, it's I mean, not... I probably am. Plus that. <laughs> Sometimes you got to own it, though, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, and it's in America, you can call yourself a bitch. It's all right. Like, I yeah, definitely am a bitch. bitch. Yeah. Would you say I'm a bitch? He called me. He froze. He froze. He said, I don't know if that's actually right for me to say. That's how I froze in the car. So. <laughs> so I should say no. In the car. But... <laughs> no, bitch. But yeah. Where'd you get, where'd you get it from though? Because like, is it from parents that you get no. that sort of vibe? Like what made you feel like, oh, I'm Because a... I felt like that with my parents too. Because they wanted me to go to college and all that. I think, I don't know. I swear I was just gifted with this mindset i mean i had a gift but i think that i just i don't know i mm. really don't know i was watching beyonce videos all the time maybe i got it from her mm. yeah, yeah, yeah i don't know yeah, yeah, yeah. but yeah is that like your earliest memory of thinking i'm going to be a singer like when did that uh i was probably like literally i don't know i was like f six or seven singing in my church choir okay but I always thought I was better than everybody, even though I sucked. I was really bad. It's like delusion. I think that delusion sometimes gets you really far if you just like live in your mm -hmm. delusion. Mm -hmm. no, like living in like your ignorance is bliss. Yeah, if yeah, I yeah. really knew the, the what's the word? Um, what's like not, the fucking... If the statistics mm. about people that make it out of Indiana, make it as an artist, blah, blah, blah. If I really knew that, I probably wouldn't even try. But I literally was so delusional. I, I was hear like, that. Like I'm going to be the biggest shit in the world one day. Yeah. Do you have an acceptance speech for an award already? Yes. Like yeah. No, yeah. but I do act She's it out all the time. She's a narcissist. I like it. She's a narcissist. <laughs> <laughs> well, you like don't practice speeches. Not never. Like, 100% You never be. know. I, pra yeah. I just, this is what I'm going to say. Like, yeah. It depends on my mood what as well. What kind of award like, do you want? <sighs> Best entertainer, best presenter, okay. best, did it, you know? And it's going, like, sometimes if I'm in a bad mood, it defo starts with fuck you niggas. <laughs> like, 100%. <laughs> that's how it starts. And, <laughs> On and, stage. Uh, I'm, I'm going yeah. to speak to that. Then in my head, I'm like, yeah, too. I can't talk. I'd have to let Tim do it. Yeah, yeah, Because yeah. if it's me. But secretly, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got a few speeches planned where I'm saying fuck you niggas as well, bro. So if you say, oh, Tim, you speak. All right, yeah. What he said, <laughs> fuck you niggas. Like, because I've got a few, I'm like dedicating to a few people. Like, they need to know, uh, yeah, I've arrived. How does your start? Mm. I'm just like, oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But I don't think I'm going to cry, though. I don't know. It depends on what happens in the moment. Mine would definitely never be like people like me don't usually win things like this. I hate that that acceptance speech. Really? Mm. That That's so shit. People <laughs> like me don't usually win things <laughs> from where I'm from. Uh, like, Are you talking about Harry Styles right now? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what he said? It, but do you think he like planned on saying that? Or do you think that that just came out in the moment? Like, I don't know what to say. Let's be sappy. Because someone else said that recently too. Yeah, I can't yeah, remember yeah. who it was. It's been like two or three people. People have done what, at, in, the at the Brits, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. not just the Brits. The there was another, there was somewhere else, another awards. Mm. Could have been the Grammys or some shit. I don't know. Mm. Something. Someone was saying some shit like that, and I'm like, people like you, mm. huh? <laughs> 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 you got to win all the time, bro. <laughs> a whole bunch of people like you just won an award today. Like, <laughs> what you mean? Hey, shit, mm. though. Let's do um, an introduction yes. so people know who we're talking to. Indeed, indeed. Night is baby show. My name is Semi Alchemy. I'm Fred Santana. Still got a shoot in the house. Yeah, yeah. The guy's shooting us, shooting everybody off these cameras right gonna now. Get some awards for it, real soon. Might get some awards for I it. Hope so. And you're drinking that good drink too. Mm. I need some more. You need some good drink. Oh. Yeah. Is that, yeah. Um, Give us two seconds. That's crazy. <laughs> nigga, overseas, underseas, or God in it, whatever God. It's my nigga VP in the cut. That's a scary sight. Yo. And we got the lovely, gorgeous Maita. Hey. <laughs> I was, I'm not gonna lie, when I was reading it, like when I first saw your name, I was like, how do you pronounce it? Yeah. Because I didn't know if it was Maita. You guys say it better than anybody in the world. Maita. Yeah. Because it's a German name. I thought I was gonna go to Germany and people were gonna say it right, but literally nobody said it right. Really? But you guys, it's supposed to be with the T, Meta. 
Meta. Right. Meta. 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 They were like just like Meta. <laughs> so, yeah. Is the surname German too? What'd you say? So your last name. Hall? Oh. I guess, but that doesn't sound German. No, that's not German. Nah. That that doesn't but they, that was their last name. That was my family's last name while they were in Germany, so I guess. Hall. What, what would that be? That like Swedish English. or yeah, some shit? Sounds English. It sounds, yeah, it sounds English. English. Oh. Yeah. I don't know. Yeah. Sounds black. black. No. Oh, well, actually, it I doesn't do, mean, do you know Mr. Hall. I do know Mr. Hall. Depends on what black. your ancestors were. <laughs> yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> it's the only way black people get them kind of names, man. It's never free. It's a whole. Where are you from, man? <laughs> What's your heritage? <laughs> I know you're enjoying this content. And you guys have been subscribing. You've been listening to us. Last month, 3K extra subscribers. We hit a spike. But there's still 40% of you guys that have not subscribed. So I'm going to need you to subscribe right now before this content resumes. We want 100K by the end of the year. You guys can make it happen, but we need you to subscribe, okay? So make sure you click subscribe. Thank you for watching. Keep tuning that's in. Not what I like. That's not like What's your hobby? category on Netflix? Like if I had to pick a genre? Yeah. Like action comedy. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Right now I'm obsessed with Bullet Train. And I was oh just like, God. that movie is so <laughs> good. <laughs> no. Thank you. You guys don't like that? They fell asleep. <laughs> Good, okay, I'm not gonna lie, I did fall asleep the first time I saw <laughs> right, it. Okay, yeah, here we go, I was here we on a go. plane the second time I watched it and I was like, this is the funniest shit ever. I was laughing she out loud. She was jet lagged. Come no, on, man. man. She had no I'll choice. You, Bullet the train is sick. We no. were Bullet train that is day. so good. It's so good, man. So you, just like Brad. you just like Brad in it, right? No, I honestly like the two best friends, whatever their names yeah, are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The black guy and the white guy. Yeah, they're my favorite. Yeah, they're cool. It's, yeah. Don't, don't, man. We I'm argued, we argued. <laughs> yeah, we yeah, did. I'm, I'm not sure about that, that, that film there still. Not too sure at all. Um, Right. Now, you're talking about all this toxic stuff, mm -hmm. especially within the music, yeah? Yeah. So, what did your first, like, who hurt you? <laughs> this man. I'm on that vibe. I'm going straight in. Who hurt you? Because that's what they do to men. Good, because I need some advice from you guys. Let's yeah, do let's it. Do it. How We're successful in relationships, by the way. Very I successful. mean, clearly, 30 and almost all married. Mm -hmm. Well, I need some help. Let's do it. Let's go back. Okay, first question yeah. for you guys. How old are your wives? Same age. Yeah, Same 30. Age. She's really? like She's like three months so older. So you're considering an older man is... is yes. That, yeah? Don't That's, do it. <laughs> I mean, I don't trust them because they're older. <laughs> you don't? Yeah, like, it's kind of weird, but yeah. I still love you. But it is, like, if I really think about it, it's like, this is kind of fucked up. Mm -hmm. And I don't, I don't believe that they want it to go anywhere. I, as a young girl, I'm like, oh, my God. But you, yeah, as yeah, a grown yeah, man, yeah. Yeah. like, you know what you're doing. Have you ever, that's exactly it. Have you ever mm -hmm. dated an older man? Yeah, that's kind of what I'm in right now. Okay. Mm. okay. So, How much older? Damn, so I'm not going to say that. But yeah, it's okay. bad. <laughs> when I say it, people are usually like, <gasps> okay. it's not horrible. It's not, like, disgusting. <laughs> it's significant, though. It is significant. She said it's disgusting. <laughs> it's going. not like disgusting, it's but it's a little raising. bit. Yeah. See, see, and like you said, it's like it's. Sometimes it's like it's there's a there's an element of, he's doing it because he might see the possibility of being able to control you more. Yeah. Mm. I mean, one hundred percent. And do you, do you like? How that? Do you feel? Yeah. I don't think that I like it, but I'm just like, why am I still here? I think maybe part part of me is fascinated by it because I think that he's sometimes just is so good at it and i feel like i've been so spending all these years trying to figure out what the f how the hell are you doing this you know but we're not together we never were together mm. we're on and off right for reasons that i won't say but mm. yeah it's very interesting i don't think that he plans on having a future with me i don't even think i have a pl plan on having a future with him so. yeah do you think you're really both having fun or just like lazy too no, because the on. the work that he does to keep this going is definitely not lazy. Mm. But it's like convenient. It's not. It's inconvenient, but I convenient think at the same time yes. because you're not committed. So it's convenient in that sense. So that when he does need it or need you, you it's very it easy to pull up and you'll be receptive. Yeah. Mm. Oh, I drive him crazy though, which I do know, and it's like you're still here. So how how do you drive him crazy? Because I do other shit, and I and he tries to. He definitely cares. Like, we've gotten you made debacles. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> would you say, that's, would you say that a man so crying is like the furthest, the furthest they'll go? 
Oh like, yeah. Like what's the a way well, that emotionally? a man? Yeah, like to. Sh- what's the thing that a man will do if they're hurt the most? Is that cry to you? Because I feel like sometimes he, f- he can even fake cry. Yes, but we could do that. Have you Ooh. fake cried before? Yes, ma'am. Oh my god. Okay, he's totally. If you can say yes that fast, he's totally was fake crying. <laughs> yeah. But I yeah, never yeah, yeah, believed yeah. it. But I was like, made up. Maybe you're just crazy and like a bitch. It's a trick. It's a trick we learned from women. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you really nice fake cry. Have you fake cried? I've yeah yeah. He was gonna <laughs> lie. Yeah. Was gonna yeah. lie. Have you? Yeah. I don't think so. I was crying. Like, I, 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 like, <laughs> like, the thing is, I was, I was if upset. I'm thinking about it, like the emotions were there and I took it mm-hmm. to cry. Yes. But yeah, I didn't yeah. have to cry, I but I realized to. it would be convenient and beneficial if I cried right now. And it works for you though. <laughs> if I be honest, yeah, it's crazy. <laughs> she left you straight away. No. What? Is it who you're? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you fucking honest, yeah. Listen, I'll be honest. If everyone gets to sharing, yeah. yeah let's wait, do, it. do your wives watch the podcast? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah oh, yeah. okay. Yeah, but she she knows all the stories. So. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does she know that you fake cried to her? Not on her. Oh, oh, okay. That was bad. What yeah. you just did. I thought, that, I thought he. I thought Fake he said it was her. Oh, okay, cool. If everyone gets a shared, yeah. Yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll, yeah, let's do it. No, not me first, dog. I was shared already. What are you talking about? Sharing about crying? Uh, nah, just toxicness. Y'all, toxicness. If, if anyone feels like opening it up the floor. I mean, I'm open, but you gotta ask I, I don't think I haven't. I, the, thing is, the thing is, you sing about it, but I haven't seen how you're actually toxic yet. <laughs> do you know what I mean? So I'd love to you. Okay, to I open think that I am toxic. I think that I love this one man, and yeah. he's so toxic. So the shit that I'm learning from him, I'll do to other men that mm. I don't care about. Wow. Damn. Which is something that I figured out because I think that I love him so much, but I know that I'm never going to get what I want. So I think that I try to fill the voids that I get from him with other men. Why wouldn't he give it to you? Do you know why? Yeah. Why, why? wouldn't he give it to you? He's married. Oof. He's, He's married, married with kids. Yeah. No. He's got kids. He's, He's got kids though. It's a vibe like that, but he's not married though. Okay. It's a vibe like that. That was a good way of yeah. admitting that. But I, I've kind of figured out that I'm never going to be that person for him. Yeah. Why so are you there? Are you yeah. Reasons that I won't say. Good sex. Okay. <laughs> good. The sex is great. Yeah. It has to be. It must. And I think that it's also a thing where when you fuck somebody for years and you build that comfort comfortability, like that's so easy to go back to. Mm. Like I don't feel like building that with a new person because mm-hmm. the sex yeah. is so good and we've spent years building that amazing sexual relationship. Mm. That's like, I don't even feel like doing it with somebody else. Like, I'll just take the shit you put me through for the amazing sex instead of having to be in some... So do you thing. think you Fucking are hell. even... Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's been in me a little bit. Because we always talk about this. We always say, oh, yeah, man, good dick could make a do that. All of this stuff. Mm-hmm. But you're actually a woman who's accepting that this is a thing. Like, Yeah. Well, because I get what I want elsewhere when it comes to feelings and emotion. So why do you not She's stringing along other on men that sort of relationship and try to build on the sex there? Do you know what I'm saying? Because if you if you get an emotion and stuff, I'm sure sex you can work on. I think it's a superiority superiority is that the word? Yeah. Because uh-huh. I feel like nobody deserves me. So it's like right. every time I'm about to get somewhere with somebody. Yeah. I know this man will never he I, I can trust him. Like he's fucked up, but he will never do some shit to expose me, never show like picture. Like he is right, like, right, right. trust. Mm-hmm. Right. Then all the other dudes, like, they just want me too much. And I just feel like mm-hmm. if you want me that bad, yeah. I feel like I'm doing charity work by letting you fuck me. <laughs> mm. No, I, I just hear haven't it. found the right person yet. <laughs> I hear it. I what, hear have it. You done charity work before? What, to let somebody fuck me? No. Have no. you? I'm not I'm not mm-hmm. I'm not popping like that. So yes, have you? Yeah. You let somebody fuck you for charity? No, nah, I fuck them for charity. Wait, what? Wait, so you didn't want to fuck them? I didn't need to. Yeah, it's in there. I didn't need oh, to. Oh, there's plenty to. of that though. Like, but you were doing them a favor. That's kind of how it feels. And mm. afterwards, like I, I, I was doing myself a favor. <laughs> I wanted enough. <laughs> I feel like as a man, it's different. Like yeah. as a woman, it's like you're probably getting more out of this than I am. So yeah. you're welcome. You know, <laughs> that, that, especially like, men don't lose in that situation. Is that one of the like exactly. you leave that night or you leave in the morning? If it's a man I don't like that night, but I'm not really good at just like fucking somebody without emotion and then leaving. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know, like I need to feel something, but I feel like that's a woman thing. I don't think that you guys are the same. No, we're not. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Post night cl- clarity. But would you, <laughs> do you leave that night? I've left I've left the night off. Yeah. yeah. But that's not your norm. What do you mean? For men? Yeah. I feel like for men, it's yeah. like, okay, if you don't like this person, 
yeah, yeah. But can does a woman accept that or does a woman like you and want you to stay? Have you met a woman that you're like having sex with and it's like bye? Like you guys really are on the same Yeah, yeah. Interesting. Yeah. What do you mean? I've met a woman that we were having sex, but we both understood we're just having sex here. Oh yeah. Mm. So I afterwards never. it'll be like, ah, right, cool, spud. <laughs> and then out. Yeah. That's really? harsh. Yeah. The spud is harsh. You, you can't get a hug tonight, man. You know what this is. <laughs> hugs, hugs be building with pouring shit. Come on, man. Yeah. But it's so mad because the reason that situation even ended is because she came to me and was like, I'm starting to get feelings. Like she's like, I know we said we weren't going to do this, but I thought I should let you know mm. that I am starting to get feelings. And I was like, all right, cool. Bye. <laughs> yeah, like I'm not. Yeah, it's like yeah, like you know what this was. So that's been over for a long time. Then. Yeah, 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 a long time. How good is your cut off game? If I don't like you, it's amazing because I've already cut you off from but the time like, it started. Verbally, not just like a physical. Oh, ghost I'm like... not good at all. <laughs> I, I, I am not good at confrontation. Disappear. It's like I've I've done. So how has that gone? In fact, let's 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 keep it on you. How how has a verbal cut off gone? Usually, I've actually never. I disappear. I ghost never because had the oh no, it, yeah, the conversations that, that have happened are because they were like tired of my bullshit and they came to me like, "What is this?" and they kind of forced it out of me. But mm. I've never been the one to come to somebody and be like, "This is over," because mm. I'm crazy. Like at the same time, it's like I'll be trying to end something, but then I'm like, "Wait, is it really over?" Like I let things just kind of fizzle out. I don't want to say this is over boom it's you done. don't have to address it yeah i don't like addressing things oh that's but horrible. that's not i mean it's toxic but at the same time it's not i don't purposely do that i think that there's part of me that's like maybe i do like you you know so i just kind of let it do its thing <laughs> but i'm not good at addressing things no how many blessings do you think you've missed out on? <laughs> <laughs> Word, you're still with this guy that is just like it's just good sex and that's it Wait, how many blessings have I missed out on? You mean, like, really? Yeah, like, how do you, do you think there's going to be people that you look back on and be like, ah, oh, he's the one that got away? Or is there anybody so far? No. And is it the me people you're meeting, they already know who you are? Or. What do you mean, like, as an artist or whatever? Yeah. It's usually. Uh, this is another toxic trait. It's usually through music, so we know. Right, what, in the studio? Mm. Yeah. Damn. LA's incestuous. Yeah, that's what I'm is. saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, that's it's my like life. That. Yeah. Damn. I can't remember the last person that was just a regular, not in the music industry person. Ew. Yeah. I'm going to sound so gross. Nah. But it's, it's not just sense. like, right. It's not just people I work with. It's just people that I meet in these certain situations, like parties, like on tour. It could mm -hmm. be a fucking. And I'm not saying this is true, but it. Okay, I'm not going to say that. Nah. Don't. Okay, don't. Can a regular guy approach you then? Yeah. How would how'd you like to be approached? They asked me this the other day, too. I think that I want a man to be obsessed with me. But that's where I struggle because it's like, I want you to be obsessed with me, but at the same time, that's going to make me feel like I'm doing charity work. So it was, it's no, like, in between. I don't know. That's crazy. How yeah. did you guys approach your On a wives? regular thing, just... Like yeah. Instagram? No, no, no on the street. Oh. In, in real, real life. life. But it wasn't like you didn't meet through work or anything like that. No. I mean, clearly, I guess not here, right? Would you no, 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 you wouldn't no, meet no, no. somebody here that Secretly, you want to meet. No, no. My missus did come on the podcast before. Oh, she yeah, 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 that's true. That's Seriously. true. Seriously. Yeah, she came. Well, I wasn't even on the podcast at the time. It was these two's podcast. Was she at that episode? I yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, what did she do? What did she do? Mm -hmm. Nothing. She was just on the there podcast. With her she just had an opinion. Oh, so yeah. she wasn't. She wasn't like sitting down on the couch. It was her episode before we didn't. Was I filming them times? I don't, I don't think, think so. we was, no, was just radar. The audio. This is when we were coming up. So it's like friend of a friend. And you when you saw her, on. were you like, I want you? Or I was knew it... her already. Oh, okay. But at that time, I would, I know she came really to see me. <laughs> 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 like, she'll never admit it. But I don't know Ego too. Yeah. <laughs> she's going to hate me. Yeah, I can tell you now. Yeah, when she sees this, she's going to grill me for it. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, we get in trouble weekly over here. Bro. Oh, yeah, really? yeah, yeah. I know I could never. Well, you could never um, do a podcast. Yeah. And talk. But your music is so, so that, like, because even I was thinking, yeah, with the, 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 um, it's a single right now, Sex, right? Mm -hmm. mm. So the, the song Sex, yeah, it's oh, about sex, like, sex, yeah. you can't spell sex without X, right? Mm -hmm. So like, you're going mm -hmm. back to him for sex. Mm -hmm. So you get a new man now, <laughs> and he hears this shit. <laughs> <laughs> so it's gone double and you're still friend with your ex. <laughs> Some of them, the new ones, know. 
and they ain't got a song. I'm not chilling no. with a babe that has a song. Nah, I can't do that. She I need my song. <laughs> <laughs> I need my I'll shit. just lie and say some shits about them. <laughs> But no. No, you can but tell no. when it's about you. The person who that one's about, yeah, he, that, knows. he knows. Oh, he you knows. can't just tell me, yeah, that, that bar there. Yeah. He first? said, I'm the ex. I didn't play for him, but he knows. He definitely knows. Because mm. we talk about it. Is it the same guy? It, yeah. Of course. Yeah. Even I knew. Every, yeah. Song, yeah. 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 every song's pretty much about the same man. Oof. Damn. Oh man, you owe him a check, bruv. <laughs> Honestly, no, a, a check or you owe some guys an apology or something because you've been wasting a whole load of guys' time. But he loves it. Of course he does. You've been stroking his ego for years. I know, it's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> she says with a smile on her face, oh, I'm good. Yeah, I, like I don't that. do it on purpose. I'm not making a song for him. I'm singing my feelings away. And then he just hears it and is like, oh, this bitch really loves me. This bitch. <laughs> <laughs> See Americans. <laughs> I can never say my wife's a bitch. This is so fucked up. (laughs) This bitch really looks after my kids. That's crazy. Damn. (laughs) That's crazy. This bitch is a good mum. That's mad. Don't try this at home. Do not try this at home. Don't try this in the UK. We are professionals. (laughs) What's so empowering about being called a bitch in America? I don't understand it. I just love that word. Yeah. I don't know. They hate it here. Yeah, but it's it's, it's the way you deliver it. I've called called, uh, my wife a bitch. Did you deliver but not well? like in a <laughs> negative way. You see, when you say it like that, it sounds yeah. mad. But I'd be like, oh, you, you my bad bitch. <laughs> <laughs> now that's different. You, you, got, it. So you have to deliver it with bitch. a little bum slap yeah. as well. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like, bitch, you can deliver yeah. it, but you have to deliver I it. Can say, I can say bad B, but <laughs> the, the itch is a bit mad still. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not gonna do You're that. You're my yeah, bad bitch. Yeah, yeah. That's, that's testing the waters. Just yeah. see how far I can push it. <laughs> so yeah, cool. Every day, a little bit further with our bullshit. Yeah. You're gonna be like a totally different but woman when you're free. You know, I've been free. Mm-mm, I was mm-mm. dating somebody else in a horse relationship, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not free. And I was actually a lot, a lot different. Somehow I fell back in. Mm. Damn, was not free. You was not free. You was on parole. But I don't know how to become free. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. The American parole. That meat mill parole. <laughs> Boss a wheelie, you're back in there, boy. <laughs> it's on parole. Oh, oh my God. You, you, ain't you never is on free. that kind what? of parole. Damn. I don't know how do you, do you want to be free? Yes. So why don't you just I'm begging to go? Be, I don't know. It's very hard. I hate, Ghost I, him. The thing is, no, I don't want to stand in the way of this man. Because I, do I, I don't want to stand in yeah, the way I, of yeah, a man. Yeah, it's true. It's true. It's true. Bro code. But yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm yeah, on a yeah. bro code thing, but at the same time, this doesn't sound good. It's not good. Hmm. I just don't know what to do. I keep going back. But then again, as a manager, I would be like, you need to keep fucking this guy because we're getting some amazing music. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I think that's another reason why I do it because... Oh Content. The, no, not for the music. For the gram. That's so, God damn. But because... In a way, it does inspire me and it keeps me feeling like I'm in a movie. Every time some shit happens, it just feels so dramatic and so passionate and blah, blah, blah. Mm. So I think that it keeps me excited. Because when I stopped it for like six, seven months, no inspiration. I was bored. Mm. Couldn't even write no bars. You're and 22. I, I hear it. Mm, yeah, I hear it. Because yeah. I'm thinking of the dumb shit I was doing at that age. I was head over heels doing stupidness for girls. Like, mm-hmm. Do you know what I'm saying? And it was like, there was no And you weren't even getting paid for it as well. I wasn't even getting paid for it. Yeah. I didn't even write a hit song <laughs> yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, makes sense. Could, could, you ma- could you write a movie off, off a, of like no. a heartbreak story? No, it would be horrible. No, <laughs> it just be it would just be shit to watch. <laughs> <laughs> it like, what the fuck's going on here, man? <laughs> He's going back again now. Yeah. Like, what's Six, going on man. here? <laughs> no happy ending. What? Now, some movies need more like non-happy endings. Though, man. Mm, have mm, you guys mm, been in my situation the man have you been that man to somebody else before well, explain the situation like just you kind of have them wrapped around your finger mm. <laughs> damn I feel so stupid oh, to no. explain yeah, this this is bad <laughs> <laughs> talking about yourself yeah. when you just wrap them around his finger I'm like yeah, wait no, yeah, yeah. 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 yeah when you, no, when you but step I'm out serious, of it though. yeah 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 because sometimes yeah. I wonder like what is he thinking I've begged him to like fucking let me go because I'm dying in this oh yeah once you did that you lost once you said, let me go, please. <laughs> please, let Stop, me go. Stop, you guys. 
<laughs> I'm gonna hear an album next year about the same shit. Oh my god! Yeah, going anywhere? Let me, just <laughs> let me go, man. I can't talk to men about it. Women have the best advice. Really? What's the advice that they? I mean, you? Uh-huh. they just help me because they're. Like, Mm. No, they don't mm. tell me to stay. Mm. They're I like, know that. It has to be the same, surely. No, it's like you're stupid. But it's from, coming from a woman, so it just feels more empowered. Me and I just mm. feel like an idiot. Yeah, that's mm. the good thing. Because, yeah, you know, that sounds horrible, but mm. this is why. <laughs> um, sometimes, like, bullying is the best way to make some people change. Like, in mm. school, mm. some people were like, bullied and in year 10 they came back new people and they were never bullied again mm-hmm. mm. sometimes you just need to be bullied into into sense or push he's gonna watch this and be like damn this bitch loves me after he sees this yeah and me talking to all the, but he knew he knew this before this podcast i though. mean he knows yeah exactly that's what i'm saying he knows your actions but is I've way louder that he knows and i'm t- like i don't know i'm not i feel like at one point i was trying to be cool i was trying to play God, like i didn't care anymore and i was just like whatever they, they say the worst, like some when you ask some people when they got out of it, like what was the worst thing about it? And they say, I stayed. Mm. That's, that's probably like, going to be me. Because sometimes know? I feel like I'm wasting my youth on this grown ass man. That's, you know that's the thing. That too? I'm sorry, to, to your point, you know why they say that? Because when you finally get out of it, get out of it and you experience life, because sometimes you're in this bubble. Mm. Right? No, it's really for sure. Nothing else but what's in that bubble. So that's what, that's going to yeah, be. Yeah, 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 that's yeah, 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 yeah. Like, yeah. That's all, the only thing that matters. But then when you get out, you're like, it's a fucking world. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You got, you got but I have felt like in. that before. So that's why I said I was free for a little bit. And maybe I wasn't really free, but there was a time when I literally was not thinking about him. Like, I really, the thought of him did not even cross my mind. Like, I literally. But I think, I think. I want to advise you, but at the same time, I don't want to hear some shit like, ah, oh, it's like Jermaine Dupri or some shit. And I wanted to get him on a podcast or some shit. And then I, uh, do you get what I'm saying? So like, is this somebody that can no, blackball us? You don't want to get him on the podcast. He's not that old. Well, I don't think. No, he's not that old. And also, you don't want to get him on the podcast. Okay, so you'll cool. be fine. Cool, cool. It's not like Gucci Mane. Or... <laughs> no, 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 no. That's just saying names now. Yeah, yeah you know what I mean? We might want to get him. Because I'm trying to figure it out. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because, yeah, yeah. like, so the thing is, yeah, I don't think you value yourself. That's harsh. It's harsh, it's the truth. No, I disagree. I disagree. The thing is, I think you men... You, <laughs> you get enough. Like, no, I have to be real. Like, I feel like women are way more sympathetic. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Let's say me and you were sitting down having a chat. I'll be more sympathetic with you because I've been through that situation as a woman. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You men, it comes across as you're laughing. Like, ah, like, how can you be in that situation? Yeah, 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 yeah. You've yeah, yeah. done it to the girls yourself. One. Yeah. And two, you're probably, like... When you're a woman, you just get it. I don't think no, no, I get it. 100%, 100%. I get it. I mean, it's a woman, to be honest, it's not a woman thing. No, no, no exactly. Thing. Men are in this situation it's, too. It's an it's a, it's a intimacy thing, right? Yes. Mm. We, we, you're not intimate, no matter how many people you have sexual relationships with, right? Yeah. You're not intimate to that extent with every one of those persons, right? Yeah. You may have this one person that you're really intimate, and that's so hard. That's what's hard to know. It's hard. Yeah. To, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. 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 You can go out and you can have sex. I've, I've done it in a relationship, slept with other people, but my heart wasn't there. It was like, okay, the nut is off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Damn, Going home. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at the yeah. dog in the mirror. That's why. That's why I wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't even say that she. Um, you don't value yourself because what you're saying to me shows me you do value yourself. Right. You're just confused as to how to get out of this because right. she's not been like, oh, I'm here and I want to be here. She's yeah. like, bro, I'm better than this. Why am I still here? So right. I can't say you don't value yeah, yourself. That's crazy because you, you said that from a kid. Like, mm-hmm. So it's like it's weird. Like, do you ha- Scale of one to ten, where's your pride? Mm. Like, I mean, would you say I'm prideful? Yeah, I don't know where you're going with this question because she's too proud for <laughs> <laughs> She said she a 20. Yeah. She's so proud she ain't leaving. Yeah, she say. said, nah, I'm not leaving. Guys, something. if you're enjoying this, click like. Mm-hmm. All right, is this, is this relationship progressing? Let's be super fucking real here. We said no filters. Is this progressing? Yes or no? No. Right, why not? What do you mean no? It's... I don't, that's a hard question because I feel like it is, it's but at not. the same time, it's like there's, I have hope for something that's never going to happen. And I think, I know it's not going to happen. I don't right. think he wants to be with me one day, but we, we treat each other like we will, you know? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it's like, I'm kind of just like. You guys are both living a lie. Like you've already spoken. But I think existence. I'm living a lie more than he is. Maybe you are. Maybe he's selling you the lie. 
But I this think, is what I it sounds like. Yeah, and I think I you think like buying it because I, you enjoy it. You you're, enjoy you're the young, transaction. No, I do. I, you're young. I think that's the what transaction's fun, to. right? Do you know what it's like? Do you, do you know, you're just young. Do you know what? It, yeah, yeah. It's, agreed. It's not, and it's not. She, you, you've got time ahead of you. So right now you can play this game. Yeah. You, 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 you yeah. can see but that there's an escape as well. You know there's an escape. You know it. Yes. You just don't really want to use that escape route right now. Because you're young. You're having yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah, you're yeah, in yeah. the industry that's new to you. The people yeah. that you're going to be meeting, they might be worse than this guy. Oh, Do you yeah, know what I mean? Yeah. But at least, oh, yeah. you know what they say? The yeah. devil you know. Yeah, yeah, so yeah, it's yeah. like, at least let me go back. If he's treating me like shit, I know at least he cares about me. Mm-hmm, Whereas mm-hmm, I can just mm-hmm. meet some next producer one day and then now I'm wrapped around his finger but he actually doesn't give a shit about yeah. me yeah that's the thing like he were you saying he does care for me yeah yeah like guy. he that's the one thing it's like every time I find somebody new what makes me always go back is like okay well he would literally do so much shit for me that this new person wouldn't mm. Mm. so cause he would he really would and he's done a lot for me mm. like he saved my ass a few times and mm. he continues to do so so do you I care don't... to share a moment yeah, what's saving your ass look like? Because so, right now we've kind of heard he the treats bad. me like shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> so yeah, what's okay, the good? Okay, well I yeah. guess he doesn't treat me. Like, I mean, the thing is, I know the situation. I just, I guess I'm just playing the victim, saying he treats me like shit, even though, like we, all, I know what it is. Mm-hmm. Um, a time he saved my ass. That doesn't give too much away. Yes, exactly. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, what's the nicest? <laughs> <laughs> deed he's done for you like what it doesn't have to be like a situation that ties him necessarily to you yeah is he flew you flown you out <laughs> yeah but that's not the kind of deeds i mean i mean like literally like as a human being but i don't think that there's anything that i could say okay fair what <laughs> he said no <laughs> yeah fair enough is it Timberland bro is it Timberland <laughs> <laughs> that's a check you should have beats next the whole time <laughs> <laughs> yeah 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 that is, it's just more of a sense of being like I'm filled when I see people go through this I'm like you need to get out of there but under, understandably it's like you're I mean, in it has there. To end eventually. Yeah, you're in there again. You're young and you're enjoying it as well. Even mm-hmm. though you might know this isn't the best thing for me, you got time. Like, but I always imagine how is this gonna end? Cause it's not gonna end well. I'm not gonna take it well. Yeah. But I don't see him ending it anytime soon. But my thing is like he's a lot older than me, so he's gonna get to a point where he needs to like you know like get married to somebody, mm. wants to have kids eventually. I'm not there yet. Mm-hmm. Mm. But how is that gonna be when that happens? Mm-hmm. You know. I'd get out of there early. Yeah, because I want to save early. myself earlier so that when that does happen, which I think is inevitable, early. I can take it better. I'm yeah. Gonna, yeah. You can move on. Yeah, save man. Save sooner than later. That's what I would say anyway. But I say, I say stay. <laughs> yeah, I'm fucking you. But he, you know, my thing is, if I do stay, he'll probably do the same shit while he is married and it does have kids. You know, it's going to be the same thing. Yeah. 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 And he can trust you. That's he, the thing. A lot of men don't do shit because they can't trust other women. Mm. Yeah. In this situation, though, what do you want to hear, people? What advice do you want to hear? Good question. I mean, I love the truth, but sometimes... I if you point that... the mic a little bit more to you. Oh, Mata. shoot. Sorry. Yeah. What do I want to hear? Mm. He loves I me. I mean, I don't want people to... No, because I don't want people to feed my delusions. Yeah. Yeah, but what is your delusion? What do you, like, what do you want to hear? I think that I have hope that I'll be with him. Even oh, if it's amazing. not... I think it's subconscious, though, because mm. if you would ask me right now to say out loud, do you think I should be together? Like, No. But I think that I've created this life in my mind where we are, and I just have hope for that. But when I'm around him, he makes it. me feel like that, you know? You're like, so aware listen, of this situation. I've just realized your mind is too powerful. Because if everything you're telling us so far, when you were back home in Indiana, I was delusional thinking I was going <laughs> to no, make it, so yeah, you that's did what it. I'm saying. Now you're in this relationship. I'm delusional, so I'm going to, like, that's you are so. She's a narcissist, bro. <laughs> I'm telling you. <laughs> like your no, mind but I think is... that's the thing. It's like, I'm going to manifest this to work. Mm-hmm. That's what you want. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I think that I yeah. believe that I really can do that. And maybe yeah. I even can, but once it, it, I get it, do I want it? Probably not. Like, I'll probably get it and be like, I really wasted all these years thinking I wanted this and now I have you. I don't even want you anymore. Sometimes I think it's the challenge of him. Yeah. Because he hasn't sub- submitted or yeah. subdued. No, he, I think he literally knows that and that's why. That's his superpower. He, doesn't, he won't give me what I want. Yeah. And I was even talking about this the other day. Like, I'm a kind of person, I don't stop until I get what I want. Mm. And I would, I'll drive myself crazy until I get what I want. And I, he's never given me what I want. And I think he knows that once I do. Because there's been kind of a time where he was like, okay, fine, I'll be with you. 
and I kind of like felt myself like go back go a back. bit. Yeah, yeah, like that's settling. Yeah, you don't want to hear yeah. that. Yeah, <laughs> fine, I'll be with you. The psychology of this is mad. Also, one time that I caught myself praying to God that I wouldn't end up with him because I felt like maybe I would say yes one day, like if that was a thing. And I remember being mm. like, God, please don't let me end up with this man. Mm. Oh, you, are, you, God doesn't know what to do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God says, this what they're doing with free will. Nah, <laughs> man, I'm take it back. Him. He doesn't know what blessing to send next. So, oh, put him no. or not, man. Decide. Word, word. Is this guy a blessing or a curse? Double-edged sword. He's giving you fantastic music. He's ruining you, though. <laughs> Word, because the music, yeah. You. I, I said, there's a not, there's an X in sex. I said, how the fuck did you think of that? How did shit? I not see that? <laughs> I've never seen that shit. I've, I've spelt sex so many times and I never realized there's EX in there. Yeah. <laughs> never realized yeah. that. I was like, oh my God, she's right. Do you guys yeah. have an ex that you, and I know your wives are going to watch this, your yeah. fiancés. Yeah. <laughs> is that what you would say but do you have an ex that you still think about no no, no come on what kind of craziness nope. impossible okay, so I don't even need a manager in there to yeah, look yeah. at me I mean, like you wouldn't say that you wouldn't say that no no you wouldn't say even if there was they wouldn't say that right now <laughs> no hell no even if there was but there isn't but yeah 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 <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> not when it's true. Not, it's not, it's not true. true. But but definitely not in that way. Do you get what I'm saying? If I thought next, I'll be like, right, it's actually mad that I was in that situation. Like yes. that's the way yeah. I would think. I wouldn't think like, oh, I missed them or like it might be just me reminiscing about childhood. Like right, that was crazy that I did that. But it wouldn't mm -hmm. ever be from a perspective of I wish that I was As with I'm this person. As I'm talking about this, does it remind you of anything in your life? Whether you were the hell man? no. You've never been in any situation similar to what I'm in. Not no. even like the slightest toxic similar. No. no. I'm trying to I could like, never. He ever. definitely yeah, look at him. No, he, he has. Yeah. No, yeah, it's, you not, have, it's yeah. not the same, but I've been in situations. Yeah. He's been but in situations where you're like in deep and you, yeah. you know that you should be out I, of I it. I was calling him. Yeah. Like, you and know, you're listening. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. I'm advised and it's like, to a point where even when I'm advising, I'm like, he's not listening. He's not going to take it. That's what I was saying. Like, he wasn't telling me what I wanted to hear, so no. I wasn't listening. Yeah, yeah, so it yeah, was yeah. until like I was trying to show him, look at it like this, though. Yeah, and he was like, "No, bro, it's, more like therapy, it's therapy instead of yeah, yeah, no, I love this I, episode. No, but this, you know, is, this, this is real. This is real. I'm feeling. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Wasn't yeah. Really nice. I, was, I wasn't listening. Yeah, and <laughs> it got worse. Why don't Why don't you think you Why do you think you didn't listen? Because you wasn't telling me what I wanted to hear. What That's did you want to hear? I wanted to hear try. Right, you, <laughs> he was telling me to leave. I, yeah, I'm I a said, real. But you don't think I should try? Listen, I'm a real I'm one. Not, Get out of there now. Like, but I'm a go trier. Now, I like to try everything. Like if, if I can't do it, I'm still gonna try. Yeah, mm. that was like, your let biggest me let me fail issue, yeah. Yeah. trying rather than not trying at all. Like, and he wasn't letting me try, so I I wasn't trying to listen to that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I you know it's it's funny. I think it's it's in it's in your DNA in terms of like you wear your heart on your sleeve. You go head first at things. And also you do sports, which is very much like, we're gonna we're competitive, we're gonna go to the end. Don't matter if we're fucking battered and bruised, we're going to that 90 minutes or that 110, whatever it is, I'm going. So I've noticed that that's just a mentality. And sometimes people bring that into relationships and that shit doesn't actually work all the time because more time you should get out of it. Like oh. this isn't something you should actually pursue or keep like going at, do you know what I mean? She's in that mode where she's like, shit, they're talking to my soul. <laughs> and basically- I'm literally spacing out, think about it right now. Like, yeah, 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 is, yeah. Like the partnership I'm in now is much better. So it's- Oh, that like, was beautiful, the partnership. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> so that's what I'm saying. You'll be a totally different woman when you're out of it. Yeah. Like it's do the you change, believe... you're going to look back and the change is going to be like, rah, this is crazy. Like, yes. The freedom I've had to grow. The yeah. Fr the freedom yeah. you'll get to grow outside of it is going to be like, you just look back and be like, rah. Do, do you think that you can miss, do you believe that certain people are supposed to be like, meant to be in your life? Like, do you yeah, think soulmates? Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. So do you think that I'm going to, do you think that I, there's a possibility that I could miss a soulmate? Or do you think that there's no way that that would miss me? I think, life? I think stars align. Just as we've even just gone through our journeys separately together, mm. like, mm. We met, we did it, we, 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 we got distant, we came back, even just how like we've met our wives, mm. just, just so much in terms of like stars aligning, like nothing's missed. Like this yeah. is just how it's supposed to happen. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's all just, like being written, isn't like, it? If I didn't do that stupid shit, 
I got nothing to learn from and I'd probably then make the mistake now. Like I was supposed yeah. to do it then. Mm. Sometimes I feel like I'm going through all the shit that I'm going through now so that when the right person comes... You're ready. Yeah. I, I have learned the lessons that I need to keep that person. 100%. Yeah, it's possible. It's possible, but you need to get out of there first. I mean, yeah. <laughs> this guy just wants you to run two miles. I, I, I'm, you know what? You know what it is, yeah? Because I genuinely believe that you're talented and I think that there's part of you that feels like this person is my backbone and they're kind of like my inspiration, they're my this. So without mm -hmm. the pain, can I still rap? I think it's, it a, it's like, like a Meek Mill sort of situation. Like it's, Meek Mill raps his Mary ass off. Right. Mm. Perfect example. Even better than Meek Mill. She's going to sing her ass off when she's going through a heartbreak. And Ooh. people love, like Mary J. Blige. Oh, okay. People love that shit. Or when, when Meek Mill has experienced death, oh my God. The rap music that he, he like, mm. it's, it's crazy. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? And I feel like there's part of you that feels like without this pain, am I still may touch. You get yeah. what I'm saying? Am I still, have I still got that? Mm. Can I still evoke that emotion? It's mad you, because that's almost could. like the pit, not like your R&B and soul in it, mm. but there's so much of that just wrapped up like in the music. Like you mm. hear the melodies and it's cold, but when you listen to the lyrics, it's like, oh, right, there's mm. something yeah. really happy. Yeah, yeah, something like, there. It's very rarely happy stuff. Like yeah, mm -hmm. in, in, in uh, even some of like Usher's songs, like, Mm. <laughs> there's some shit going on in there yeah, like, and you're yeah, like bro yeah, you yeah. writ that out of a real situation real pain and it's a fucking <laughs> bang and we, shit is crazy. we like, just that's the evolution that shit, of like, R&B isn't it yeah. that we see because yeah. I know back in the day it was all love making yeah. do you know what I mean yeah. Like, yeah. everybody was in love yeah. and now you just kind of seen it evolve into everybody's in pain like, yeah. like, but I love that shit like, I'm yeah. sitting there like I'm not in a happy relationship <laughs> trying to put myself in that mode of... Yeah. yeah. You couldn't write no good albums now. Nah. No, no. But you, you don't need that. You don't you don't need that in order to make good music. You just need to make good music. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? But I don't think you need that. Do you know what I'm saying? Because I think that that's going to be... Soon enough, that's going to take over. And then you won't be able to make music. I know. It's going to like... Yeah. I you know? think he's gonna come here and tell us how you was messing with guys, like yeah, you ain't you know? toxic. Yeah, yeah, to you. you ain't toxic like that. <laughs> I mean, you ain't like that toxic to a few people. Yeah, but I'm saying like I'm learning it off from this man. Like I've done the sh same shit he's done to me back to him, and we didn't talk for months. And it's like, but you did that shit to me. Like what? Mm. You know? <laughs> and it's unfair. Yeah. So what do your friends think about this? Oh, they literally all hate him. Oh mm. man, Ooh, that's not how do you situation. deal? Like, cause you know, there's there's situations where it's like the girls or the guys don't like their friend's partner, mm -hmm. but that person has to be around. Like, how do you even deal with that? Like, is that comfortable? Is I mean, it people enjoy him as a person. He's a good person. Like, yeah. and it's funny because I've some of my friends think he's evil. They don't want anything to do with him. But others yeah. are like, as a person, I don't like the way he treats you. But he is a good person and he's fun to be around. Blah blah blah. So like, they'll. They'll enjoy him. That's fucking money bag, yo, they, man. They don't. It's <laughs> fucking money bag, innit? <laughs> yo, no. I swear a sex tape just came out of him. I swear it down. Like, like, I have no Allegedly. Idea. <laughs> oh, no. But yeah, they know that they're never going to be able to tell me what to do, though. Because it's been years of them saying the same shit, and I've never... I don't listen... Like, I don't listen to anybody. Mm. But I'm a Pisces. That's like a Pisces thing. Yeah. Like, I'll take advice from everybody, but am I going to listen to anything you say? No, I'm going to do what I want. <laughs> and I keep it in mind. <laughs> so I'm what are you guys' birthdays? I'm gonna do that annoying thing. Yeah. Oh, well, we had a uh, tarot tarot card Ta reading. Tarot. Yeah. Oh, you did. Yeah, we, yeah. Yeah, we was had it, it real stuff. Yeah. yeah. Like, did it? Did it? Yeah. Um, yeah. When well, yeah, they basically said the shit's about to pop off in May. Yeah. So, oh, know, well, congrats. You know, yeah. We we're working towards May, whatever's coming. But um, yeah, we're both May 9, 12, oh, August, August 8th. August eighth. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. yeah. So. Wait. So what's that, Taurus? Yeah. What's, yeah. What? 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 Go he's on, a Taurus. Go on, please explain. He's a what? Taurus. You just no. He's not a Taurus. Okay. Yeah. You guys are just stubborn. Oh, no. That's the only thing I know. Who's about Taurus is. Taurus is. He's stubborn. Do you think? Wait. <laughs> See, you Do you like think he's now that we he's stubborn? stubborn. He is, yeah, he you is. are stubborn. Yeah, 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 yeah. You struggle to say like, oh my bad, I'm sorry. Like you struggle. Like you always fight back first. Like and it's like, bro. You know you did something nah, wrong. Man, I'm fighting back. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But that's not stubborn. You're stubborn to a degree. You it just is, display man. it in another yeah, way. Differently is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I just don't talk. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I just won't say yeah. shit. No, but you you go out your way to be stubborn, bro. I'm, that's 
spiteful. I'm spite. Yes. I'm spiteful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And stubborn. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Like even worse. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I know <laughs> me. I know me. That's the thing. Like people, people will like sometimes say shit to me as if I don't know that about myself, and I'm like, I know. Yeah, yeah. yeah I know yeah, I'm yeah, this yeah, way, yeah. and this is like the character development. Like, I, there's some yeah. things that I will change, and some things that I just know. Mm. I'm just going to be this way. Dude. Mm. It, it's it's just, easier mm. to be this way for me. Mm. Go on. No one. Nothing. Well, I don't want to get too deep. No, I'm getting deep. Is there something that you I'm... actually want to change? Like, versus something that you know about yourself? Is there something that you feel like you need to work on? Um, mm. Yeah. What, what's something that I want to work on now? Maybe just being more open about feelings. I do. Not mm. like, oh, I love you, babe. Like, that's easy. It's just like, yeah. if something's going wrong or... Mm. I'll just I'll, I'll, I'll bottle feel. it up for a couple of days and then we explode, innit? Interesting. But mm. so it's just it's just getting better with that. And I've I've tried therapy. That was horrible. Have you I tried? don't really enjoy therapy. Mm. You don't. She was she was kind of like. Did she like, tell you what we told you? Or no, she kind of was like, "All right, do what you want." And oh, I was really? like, that's not what I wanted to say. <laughs> yeah, that's, like, I paid for that. Oh, yeah, like it just felt like I was talking to my own self. Mm. Like, yeah. I, I think I needed her to be like, you are fucking slow right now. Like, yeah. You are fucking slow right now. Yeah. Did that help? No. <laughs> See? <laughs> it don't matter. It don't matter who says it. It's going to be you that makes a change. Yeah. I don't think anything, anybody saying anything, because I'm sure you're telling her all the time to the point where you ain't even telling her no more because you're tired. Oh, 100%. <laughs> I can see. Are you I not happy with this? like the person you are, though? Or do you think <clears throat> there's room for there's room there's for definitely improvement? Room for improvement. Mm. Yeah. Or do you want to improve? How do I put this? Like, there's, there's certain times where I'm just like selfish mm. with my time. Like, mm. so mm. I've, I, I know, okay, yes, I've been doing a lot of work here, but at home, I haven't been doing a lot of work. Mm. I now have time where I can now do work at home, mm. but because I've been doing so much here, I'll be like, nah, fuck that. This is my time. My time, yeah, yeah. Mm. So I'm selfish with that time where I know, really and truthfully, I should be using that time to improve the house or something. Do you know what I mean? Mm. So I'm, that's something that I want to try and improve on, but it's fucking hard, bruv. Like, mm. like, we always talk about not burning out. So in my head, I'm like, I'm just trying not to burn out. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, but really mm -hmm. and truthfully it might not take me as long as I think it would take me yeah but when... I don't know I think these, the first couple months of the year is hard graph like if you're taking hard. holidays in Q1 yeah you're fucking about man really <laughs> you reckon yeah man this is, this is where you lay foundations for like the rest, rest of the year, year. Yeah, like, yeah, if yeah. you're on holiday you're just missing out on all the planning mm. it's like yeah, you try yeah, to come yeah. back in June and pick shit up. It's like, hey, we planned this in February. Yeah, my yeah, guys. budgets have been yeah, spent. It's, yeah, it's all done. So, yeah. like, <laughs> what, what about what about you? Um, I'm. It's more to do with the like, kind of what Kel said about like, oh, you know, being right all the time or just trying to approach situations different. Because I feel like when I feel like I know something, I just have to say it. And mm. sometimes you don't have to say that shit. Like, sometimes you can just be like, all right, cool, it's fine. Maybe that's your way of approaching it. This is mine. That's all right. So sometimes I'll I'll respond to something and then later on I'll, re I'll like replay it in my head and I'll be like, I didn't need to say that. Or why did I say that? I could have just respected the person's opinion or respected that we're not on the same page and just been cool. But instead I feel like, no, I need to make you on the same page as me because I'm on the right page, you're on the wrong page. Yeah. So... That's where I need to improve. Just like we can both be right or we can both be wrong. Like it's all right. No one can be more right than the other in some situations. Sometimes I'm fucking right. <laughs> but I'm it, not, I, the thing is, yeah, I'm rarely right. And it, I'm not even mad about that. Do you know what I mean? Like I don't, I don't care to be right all the time. Yeah. I just want to say what I want to say. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah, care yeah. if I'm right or not. How about you? Uh, accountability. Accountability. Yeah. I've been having a lot of like people giving me uh, interventions yeah but like many interventions kind of just one of those things where you're like oh, like really yeah. <laughs> like, you think that and it's been a lot of like accountability I guess I'm yeah like, I gotta stop playing the victim have you ever done mm. spiritual healing no I have you so. what's the issue here I want to know what spiritual <laughs> healing is like what, <laughs> what do you mean <laughs> spiritual healing what, yeah. what, what did you mean by that? that meditation oh, okay, oh, okay. Right, cool. <laughs> it does work 
Well, I need to meditate. I need to meditate. I need to meditate. I like listening to this this gospel singer from Ghana. That's what I. That's oh, what yeah? I'm from. What's his really? name? It's a girl, Sumi Sola. Okay, I don't know. You yeah. should listen. She sounds she's, Nigerian. She does. Sumi Sola? Yes. Yeah, yeah. 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 Maybe she, no, I'm pretty sure she's from Ghana. She lives in Ghana. But it's amazing. <laughs> when I listen to that, it's like everything's going to be okay. Gonna Gospel's be okay. cold, you know. Oh, yeah. Gospel is amazing. It, it's, like, it really can start your day off right. I like, started it's really like, that yeah. this year. I said, rah. Yeah. We're going to have to do this every Sunday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. You go to church? Yeah. Not yet. Are there good churches in London? Depends. I'd say, I'd say my family Spack. church is a good church. <laughs> <Spack. laughs> Don't think that. <laughs> that's, a, that's, a, that's a London thing, that's boy. That's a London thing, yeah. Jesus Christ. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't know, like, church kind of faded, man. Yeah, like, I don't know. When I, we was kids. I stopped believing, not in God, but I stopped believing in the people that are preaching him. Do you know what I mean? I started thinking, yeah. like, I don't know what you're on though, man. I don't know who you, you are. Like, you. Yeah, yeah, then you hear stories. I'm like, oh, nah, man. I'd rather just have my own relationship and I know I'm speaking to God or I'm, do you know They're what I mean? church in LA. <laughs> you said not in the church in LA. <laughs> I just said it's the devil's playground. Yeah. Like. There's churches, but they're all in, they're like you know, like if you go to church in Vegas, that's not really church. No. So I'm just trying to, yeah. I'm just trying yeah, to yeah, understand yeah, yeah, what's right, LA right. like. It's like very few good ones. <laughs> <laughs> they're not, is there, but is there good churches? Like I've, I've seen. No, a lot of them. I've been to a few yes. churches. I've been to a few churches in LA, and it's it literally feels like an Instagram church. What kind mm. of church? Like, is it like hallelujah, press, like hold your like, head? Like, I swear, faint. it was after, it was like right when I first moved to LA. I went to church with my friends, and I was like, I was like in disbelief at the things that this man was saying, and people pretending to like feel the Holy Spirit. Like, mm. he was literally reading like Instagram captions on stage, but saying it with, with like with passion. Mm -hmm. And I was just like, what? It just felt so fake. Mm. And I remember, and it's like maybe it's because I just moved here or something. I'm just like my brain is fresh. I don't yeah, believe yeah, this yeah. stuff you're saying. But I was like, this is not real church. It didn't. I felt nothing. Everybody felt very fake and kind of fake friendly. And I don't want to say that about people in church, but it, I don't. I didn't believe it. My intuition was like, mm. Mm. but there have been some good churches. But I just noticed that they're not the ones that live stream and have. They're not like mm -hmm. uh, two hundred thousand followers on Instagram, like. Damn, like the church with them kind of followers. That's crazy. That's so. crazy. They got brand deals. <laughs> <laughs> they got ads. That's a hashtag ad. We love Jesus. That's crazy. Yeah, <laughs> they start selling merch and stuff yeah. like that. It's just, that doesn't feel like a real church to me. <laughs> yeah. so you grew up in church then because you were in the choir? Or? Yeah. But I feel like sp my, I'm not religious, I, would, I wouldn't I would say. I was raised like a Christian, but I think that I'm just spiritual. I believe in, I believe you find God in yourself. I don't think that you find it. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watching Joel or like. Mm. I agree. <laughs> I yeah. agree. But sometimes I think, is that because I'm just lazy and I don't want to go to church? Like, yeah. I'm just like, oh, fuck it, God's in me. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, fuck it, God's in me. <laughs> would you panic if she became a gospel singer? I've actually thought about that. Would you panic? <laughs> no. Why would, why would I well, no? Might be like, I've, shoot, them, them niggas ain't going number one like that. I've where I'm like, no, I'm giving I mean, this that, up that, and I'm doing gospel. Yeah. Mm. Like, I would, I honestly don't want to, I would panic if I want to be a gospel singer. Mm. That's not if you want to be, if you became, that means God is working, that means you've been delivered, that means you now is doing the Evangelist. But can I be mm. not doing, I mean, I guess not singing about toxic stuff, but you I'm saying like. You about toxic stuff and be a gospel singer, that doesn't matter. No, I'm not mm. saying do both. But you can say what you But I'm saying I can still be like. A human and live life? That's I know, but are you saying a gospel singer isn't a human living life? Yes, nobody's perfect. So That's what two things do you want to do at the same time? What do you mean? You want to be a gospel singer and do what at the same no, time? No, I'm saying because he was like, <laughs> he, you were like, would you freak out if she became a gospel singer? And he was like, no, that means that she's doing the God's work. She's, I'm like, can somebody not do that? Can somebody that's not doing gospel do that also? Yeah, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, you're yeah, doing yeah, God's yeah. work yeah. right now. But yeah. speaking about oh, sex, I mean, I'm not saying, it's no, not God's work. No, 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 but it not. is because somebody's is hearing it? that and they're going to change through her. What? Sounds like fornication oh. to me. No, but you know what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> what he's saying is this could be therapy for somebody else. Exactly. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. Like somebody okay. else could see you as a warning. Like, okay, this is what she's been going through. I need to watch out <laughs> for these things. Not. That was sad. That was sad. <laughs> not a warning, but you know what I mean. It's a don't live your life like this. Here's my take. 
I basically am doing God's work. Exactly. Yeah. There you go. You're the sacrificial <laughs> lamb. You should have never, never said that to her. Right? <laughs> the, the sacrificial lamb. You're a dumb. <laughs> but one day I'm going to be out of it and maybe I'll be a gospel singer. And yeah. you'll be back here telling us about it. Mm. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll be back here married or something. Oh, hey. Hey. That would be... Uh, hey. Oh, my God. I'll take some credit for that. Oh, yeah. my God. Yes. If you All came credit. here with some stuff here... I'm yeah. trying to be best man. I'm saying... <laughs> <laughs> I deserve I saying, it. Yeah, so won't he do it? Won't he do it? God did. God did. Yeah, yeah. Proper. That would be that would be a serious glow up. That would be that's cool. a thing. I'm, yeah, that would be a serious thing. That'd be <laughs> nice glow up. Um, where was you gonna go with it? Okay, so cool. You're in um LA, and that's where you're working with Pharrell, right? Mm -hmm. How did that come Miami. about? Wyoming. Wyoming. Miami. Oh, Miami. Mm. Um. Well. My NR was in a meeting with him and played him some of my songs on my upcoming project, Sex, out April. Oh, the 14th. whole project is called Sex now. Well, because it's about him. <laughs> <laughs> Guys. I thought it was just a single. I mean, Fuck. it is a single, but it's like the whole story is kind of about that situation. Mm -hmm. Heard. Right. Got you. How many tracks? 11. Cool. So he played Pharrell some of that. Pharrell loved it. He was like, I want to work with her. So I flew to Miami and spent a few days with him. And yeah, so we're but we're working on my album now. Yeah. So like next year project. But he he was so inspired that he wanted to like create my sound for the album. So I'm gonna do a few more days with him. That's mm. amazing. Like, like, your voice is crazy. Yeah. I, yeah. I remember I yeah. put on Spotify the other day and you was in the playlist. Mm. I was like, Okay, I need to I need to do some more some more research. Mm. I was like, No, this is some serious talent. Mm. Yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Proper. Proper. Like yeah. verbal gymnastics. Mm. Thank you. Yeah, I think it's better. But yeah, so we'll see what my album sounds like. Mm. Eleven Robian tracks of that though. Yeah, producer. that's that's getting in the, my playlist. Mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Like the, you, it's definitely. And it's got not in all playlist. toxic. I mean, most of it is, but it's not all toxic. Yeah, it just takes you through that relationship, but it's like all the good stuff too. Mm -hmm. Do you think like what about like you know like a lot of rappers like they won't necessarily have gone through something, but they might say, oh my my friend went through it so I'm going to rap from his perspective mm -hmm. and they'll lie about it or they'll just rap from a different perspective. Yeah. Could you do that with R&B? Yeah, I do it all the time. Yeah? If I don't completely write a song, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like okay. I'll, I'll yeah. sing songs that, sometimes I'll get songs sent to me that's like, literally that's what I'm going through but sometimes it's some shit I've literally never gone through but I still like to play that character and pretend that I have. Yeah. You know? Cool. Yeah. It's, I honestly believe that that's also manifesting because mm. I swear every project I sing Okay, never mind, because it's all been about the man, so. Mm. But I, I swear, like, when I sing songs, my life becomes that. There's been times that I've I've written a song, imagining a certain scenario, and it happens. Like, I swear my music is manifestation, so maybe I should stop singing about this toxic shit so that my life isn't toxic anymore. Mm. But I do believe what I sing is manifesting. Yeah. The only thing is, no one wants to hear that happy shit all the time, though. That's the yeah. only thing. You see what they did to Chance the Rapper? What are they doing? Dang. Yeah, no, the, the, the what are they getting him out? No, of the no, song, just, the album about his the big day. wife and they all of that. They hated that shit. Oh, that shit yeah. was amazing. I didn't even go That's check for that. Was man. it amazing? Bring me I that. Don't think I ever listened bring to me that acid rap. Tell me about when he was high. <laughs> you know what I mean, that shit was great to me. I thought you still it was listen good. To it? But yeah, I listened to that. But that's because you have a wife. Yeah, mm. but uh, it's crazy. People want that acid. He's got a wife too. He yeah, wants the acid we want rap. acid rap. He wants the drugs. Oh, okay. Yeah, we want that. That album was good, man. I liked it. Have Even you had Coloring Book? That yeah, I liked that, that too. Coloring yeah. Book was cool. Good stuff. Yeah, yeah. Have you um? Have you ever tried? What's your English accent like? It's so good. Like, it's really good. <laughs> <laughs> that was, right. <laughs> no, that people, was good. People that actually bad. Tell, no, because now that I'm actually thinking about it, people tell me it's good. That was no, that bad. was good. But what it's you when just I'm not did. trying. Okay, that was bad. No, but that was. I don't know. No, that was bad. It's all the, right. The, that was like, bad. It was good. Like I feel like some it goes in and out, in and out. How do you say in and out? In and out. I don't fucking know. <laughs> you need to remove the T's. Yeah, in, in and, and out. out. In and out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So let's let's, let's say you um put the kettle on. What? Put the kettle on. Put the kettle on. Okay. That's hard to say. Put though. the kettle on's hard. Put, put the, the kettle, kettle on. on is hard. Kettle, kettle. Put the kettle on. Kettle's good. Kettle on. Put the kettle on. <laughs> yeah, 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 you're good. Do you guys say kettle? Yeah. What do you what do? You say kettles? pot. The teapot. Yeah. Put the pot. Put, <laughs> put the pot on the fire. Put the pot. <laughs> <laughs> put, 
<laughs> Heat that pot of water. Yeah, because you don't really drink tea. Put a cat on his basic. I mean, we do, but it's like. Iced tea. A lot of microwaving going on in America. Oh, oh yeah. So you microwave. guys don't microwave your water. What? Microwave water? Why do we need to microwave? <laughs> the water's already I done. Really microwave, I'll boil it sometimes. But that's like so much work. I've seen people make tea in the microwave. I've, that's the only time. But I've never seen someone just go and heat wait, water wait, up wait. in the microwave. Heating water up is work. How? Because you got to wait for it to unboil. Wait, what are you doing with this water? What? When you make tea... Yeah. yeah. Doesn't it get to a really hot place? Well, why are you, you in such a rush to drink it? Tea is like a half an hour drink. We make it, we let it sit for us a couple of years, and then we drink. You don't just. I'm, I don't want that. <laughs> <laughs> just drinking it in two minutes. What's the rush? I don't like hot drinks for that reason, though. I don't like that I, to wait. Like I'm yeah, me too. So, <laughs> so I just don't drink hot drinks. But you're talking about I'm well, boiled. I want to make it myself. I like, I was at this hotel when I was here last time and I had so much tea because it came ready. It came the right temperature. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. If yeah. I'm making the water, I got to wait for the water to cool. Like, that, ugh. What? What's the right way to do hot chocolate? Apparently, milk. just milk and heat up the milk. But no, water? like some, yeah, you, some people. I, I was doing it with, when I was younger. I was doing it with hot water that hot whole water, time. And then yeah. you add a bit of milk. Yeah. It was not. It was not the same. Once so I discovered no water, it's just warm milk in the microwave. Yeah, no. You you put that on. You the... guys just said anti microwave everything, and now you're saying no, no milk. You could put milk in the microwave. Yeah, you but could... you would. Okay, so if you're making tea, you wouldn't. Which is kind you of you wouldn't backwards. microwave tea, but you would microwave milk. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's backwards. That to doesn't be make fair. How's that yeah. backwards? So like, you want that milk, like milk. I wouldn't you're put gonna milk in my kettle. Yeah, but that's, you can put it on the uh, saucepan. Oh. Yeah, but that's long. That's long. That's long. Do you know what I'm saying? But a kettle, you put water in there, it's mm. going to boil in less than a minute. What about the thing? So you guys have like an old fashioned kettle, or is it like one of the things <laughs> where you like press the button? No, you just press the button. Yeah, you press the button. Oh, yeah. that's so easy. Oh, you put water yeah. in yeah. the actual like, on the stove. Yeah. 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 <laughs> like she's thinking that the kettle's going. Yeah. No, That's we don't what have I was that. imagining. No, no, we, not, we, we don't live in the past. Oh, we just live I in mean, the UK. Earlier, you guys were talking like you live in the past. No, oh, that's our age. Yeah, that's our age. Yeah, it's true. What I do in school and stuff. I've never lived the life of putting a pot on a. Oh, I think yeah. I just saw my grandma doing that as a kid. So that's what I imagine you guys were talking about. Oh yeah, but you're from country, isn't that? A... Yeah, I, mean, I had a microwave too. <laughs> <laughs> but no kettle. We, my grandma did it. I didn't do that, though. Oh, fair but enough. But I guess the one now, that's so easy. Okay, yeah. so I agree, I agree. Yeah. When you say country, I, I, I picture caravans for some why? reason. I don't know why. No, that's a different era. That's Ozark. I'm like so <laughs> suburban. I'm trying to think of a movie where you could imagine. Stranger Things. Yeah, yeah, kind of like that. Right. Just imagine a bunch of houses, they all look the same. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Like we just run- I mean, I did kind of have a, a childhood, though, where you just knock on somebody's door. Yeah. Like we would just run around each other's neighborhoods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Knock on them. Yeah, like I guess, I guess I did. Do you know what I always wanted? I always wanted to live in a cul-de-sac when I was when yeah. I was younger. Like I when think you go it's there, and it's like, Eddie, like there's there's yeah, there's houses on saying, the, yeah on the, on the even San Andreas was like that. Your yeah. home was like that. You go there and then there's like four or five houses just on the circle just bit playing in the in the in the road. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. So when does the when does the tape drop? Is it a tape or? It's an album's next year, right? Yeah, album's next year. I just started working on it. The project is going to be April 14th. And it's called mm-hmm. Sex. And it just takes you through my love life. Cool. But it's really good. Any features on there? Any big names? The Dream wrote a song. Oh, okay. Lucky okay. Day wrote a song. Okay. Right. Lonnie wrote that one. Mm. James Fontenoy, if you guys know James Fontenoy. Yeah, Fontenoy. yeah, yeah. I yeah. like James Fontenoy. So it's really man. good. It's a lot of good people on there. Nice. Right. Tracks. All right then. But what we do before we wrap up the show is go through some trivia. Mm-hmm. So we got some questions for you. Okay. Um, I'm going to read you your rights, your lifelines. You got four of them. Mm, okay. We usually say you can phone a partner, but you got a, a team behind the camera to help you. Yeah, but they can only right. help you once. What's the if I literally can't get anything right? There's That's lifelines. Fine. What's Even lifeline? if you can't get it right, it's fine. You yeah. just lose a point. Yeah. And you don't make it to the leaderboard. Who's one? Who's the best? Uh, B. Simone and Meg. How many questions is it? Ten questions. Oh, okay. <laughs> That's why you didn't like the school questions, huh? Yeah. Um, all right, so you can ask the team behind. No one can use Google. No one can use Spotify. No one can use their phone, basically. Okay. It's all up here. you got one multiple choice option. So if you're stuck, you ask for multiple choice. And we'll read you four answers. And you pick the right one, hopefully. Okay. 
You could ask a 90s baby. That means if I ask you the question. Oh, I'm not going to know any of these. I already know it. No, you'd be all right. You'd be all right. Mm. Uh, you could ask Tem or VP for help. Or you can skip. If you skip, you don't lose a point. But you can only do that once. Okay. And on the last question, it's worth 10 points. There's a lot of options on here. Mm-hmm. I know that, that you're going to be like, this is the worst time we've ever seen this game. No. Oh, okay. it's, it's been <laughs> horrible. Nah, I think yeah, I'm going to yeah. get none. But okay, here we go. Oh, you're being minus. Uh, but I'm a mm. 2000s baby. Mm, don't worry. Yeah. We get it to you. A little bit. You ready? Okay. <laughs> okay. What was the most searched TV show in 2022? Oh. Oh, um, what's that one? I know what it's called. The, the, the one where they're in a game, they all shoot each other. They walk to the the doll and it goes like this. In 2022? Is that what you Was yours? that not last year? I don't know. You, you know what me. I'm talking about, Yeah, though. but you tell me. Is... So clearly that's not the right answer. <sighs> we just need, we just need <laughs> eight answers. Oh, was it, was it the girl with the all black hair? Who's that? What, what are these shows? Like? You know, what show I think... Okay, fuck. Can I ask him for the name even though I already answered? Well, you ain't gave... You, have, you haven't given an answer yet. You can ask. But that's going to be my... That would be one lifeline, yeah. It's called... You know what I'm... You guys know what I'm talking about. Yeah, today. I know. Yeah, I know. About, but you need to say that shit. <laughs> okay, what is it? Uh, well, are you are you oh. using a lifeline? No. <laughs> okay. I don't know if they know even that. Is it called Squid Game? Is it Squid Game? That is what you're thinking of, but that's incorrect. I'm, I'm hmm. you. That was 2021. Mm. That was really 2021? Yeah. yeah. Hmm. Was last last year, year was Stranger Things. Oh, Fuck, wrong. I wasn't even say that because you already answered, you already mm. talked about Stranger mm. Things. Don't worry about it. I did it. not know that. Mm. It's crazy. Um, that's mad. I need to watch How that. many monthly streams do you get on Spotify? Well, it's gone up. Mm. Right now it's like, a million something, but it was like a month ago, 600,000. Mm. So what's your answer? I mean, if you check today, it's like a million something. What if he's like, no, it's actually 200,000 today. So. <laughs> 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 I would say it's a so we're going to have to uh, give you a, a thumbs down on that one. It's, it's 965,000. <gasps> it was close. Oh, mm. That's a round up thing. Mm. Uh, but that's a big round up though. <laughs> mm. That's a big round up. Damn. Maybe if you, today what time <gasps> oh my god i'm failing it's march it's march, oh, march. march. It, was, it was a million like two days ago damn ah, yeah okay so was me on the show, need that for to drop boy we, <laughs> no. we get half know. point so we out <laughs> nah, 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 nah nah sorry about that <laughs> all right then um why was ice spice trending recently because drake followed her again Sorry. Oh, well, that no. was today. Yesterday. No. Is that video her jumping on top of the basketball thing? No. Nope. No, no. It's, um... Oh, wait, wait. I want to call. I want to call on my friend. It's too late. <laughs> oh. <laughs> she was allegedly dating Pete Davidson. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. I saw that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I yeah, saw yeah. that. Everybody's dating Pete Davidson. Mm-hmm. You know? Yeah. You next. That's it? just like a buck. Like, every girl in bucket is Pete Davidson. <laughs> on to Tem. Right. Um, what is the tech hub in San Francisco called? Oh, that's easy. Google? Jesus, it's Lord. Oh, fuck. Apple. No. Oh. <laughs> Silicon Stop Valley. answering. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Silicon Tech Valley. Hub? <laughs> yeah. I yeah. thought you meant like a company. Oh, okay. You guys just need to speak it. Oh, never mind. It's, so it's, it's an English. accent. It's an accent. <laughs> Sorry. It is the accent. All right. How many copies of Confessions did Usher sell worldwide? I'll give you a million either side. A million what? Like a million other side. If you was to be up by one million or below one million. Oh, so it's like millions. Like 10 million. Well done. It was 10. Oh. It was 10 on the dot. Nice. Well wow, done. Oh, made a... <laughs> you got a question right. Well done. Oh. <laughs> All right. Which country in the American continent has the queen on their money? Which country so, in the... Mid- what con- how is that a co- America's a continent. America's a continent, not the United Which States. North, North America. Oh, I guess that's true because there's like. She's looking for answers. Isn't like, I don't want to sound like an idiot, mm. but I don't know that much about geography. Or that's anything. all right. Okay. Like Puerto, Puerto mm. Rico. Rico is like a whole thing, and that's like, like you don't need a passport. To I'll fuck. Get yeah. There. <laughs> you guys are making me nervous. I right, listen. You don't. Is that need your to answer? Be. 
No, wait, no, what was the question? Really never, are there different places? I said, which country in the American continent has the queen on their tender? As in on their money? On their yeah, on their money, tender. yeah. Their legal oh, tender. Okay. Legal tender. Oh, I know. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I really no, know on answer. money. Okay, I'm yeah. ask, no. <laughs> Multiple choice. Multiple good choice? One, good, one, good, good one, good one. You guys have to remind me that I have these options. Yeah. Good one, good one, good one. Is it Argentina? Is it Canada? Is it Puerto Rico? Or is it Cuba? Which one of those has a queen, first of all? It's either Puerto Rico or Cuba. By the way, the queen, as in the queen of England. Oh, I don't even know the, I don't even know the history enough to know which one of them <laughs> dealt with who. <laughs> Puerto Rico. It's not Puerto Rico. It's, it's Cuba. No, was that a, a multiple choice? That was a multiple choice. choice. Cuba. I'm gonna just say Cuba. No, it's Canada. Canada. Of course, yeah. It's Canada. Canada. Break the question now. <laughs> you said which country in the American continent? On the Ameri- okay, so you gotta think about. The countries in America. The, the, the continent yeah. Is you guys are ignorant. Oh, when okay. we say America, you're like the States. No, it's a continent. <laughs> <laughs> you need to remember that shit. Well, North America is a continent, but right? The Queen of England. Mm-hmm. Oh, I guess mm-hmm. because they've. Yeah. No, so you can't technically use that because if North America is a continent, South, well, South America is a continent too. Mm-hmm. North America is so, not. You said which kind? Con- Wait, what was the question? <laughs> <laughs> we just move on. I, I yeah, like she got it wrong. Which of the Americas? Which country in the American continent has the queen on their tender? That's still the same. Yeah, thing. yeah. I knew it was Canada. <laughs> it's Canada. Well, you said the queen. Look, I'm only thinking Canada was a part of yeah. the you, British you, Empire. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. That's Next. all good. It's all good. Yeah, was that three was, questions? Yeah. yeah, that was. Oh, sweet. okay. It's my turn. All right. Cool. Question one. <laughs> what does La- what does Lady Gaga affectionately call her fans? Monsters. I'll give that to you. It's little monsters. I'll give that to you. Okay. Cool. Yeah. 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 There you go. She okay. calls her fans little monsters. Yeah. Wow. Question two. The J in Mary J. Blige. Mm-hmm. What does it stand for? I'm gonna call my friend. Jane. There you go. It's a point. Mm. It's a point. Thanks. Look I at this. One. Comeback season. Comeback season. season. All right. And the last question. In what Thanks. state was NBA legend Larry Bird born? Indiana. There you go. Okay. <laughs> okay. okay. Round away. Okay. All right. They're gonna you're in, you can't you're come in back like, home. you're minus four at the moment. Mm-hmm. Okay. This question is worth 10 marks. Okay. You get to pick who asks you the question for 10 marks. Okay. We're going <laughs> so already, you don't even know what I'm about. We're going to tell you our genres first. Yeah. Uh, I got music. I got English. Okay, so no. I got music award shows. I do that, I guess. Yeah? Okay. Because your music is broad. Very. That could be mm. like do you want to narrow it for her? or <sighs> Albums. Albums. Music albums. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Pharrell. I'm going to go with you. Yeah? Okay. Who won the top R&B male artist on the Billboard Music Awards in 2018? 20. I don't get multiple choice. No. What, life, like what life fans has she got left? She's got Arts One of Us and she's got Skip. But you don't want to skip. You don't want to skip now. <laughs> you don't want to skip. This is a 10 point question. So I can ask one of you guys? Can well, I ask the man know. with the answers? Nope, nope. <laughs> so who do, I, who do I ask? What was the question? So what if you guys lie and pretend that you're oh, not? No, no, we wouldn't lie. We wouldn't lie. I'll just tell you. No, I don't know. No. Who won top R&B male artist at Billboard Music Awards in 2018? 2018. Mm-hmm. It's not Daniel Caesar. 2018. What was it? Can I, are they white or black? Or anything else? I can't say nothing else. Here's your other option. You could take one of our questions for five marks. No, I want to. Can I? Can I ask one of you guys? You can, but yeah. I'm gonna just do that. I've got you. a guess for you. Who? You don't have to take it, but he can guess. 2018. Where was I in 2018? Was it Jaquise? That's who I wanted to say, but I know it's not him. I know that guy. Went, 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 went in on that. I'm gonna say Usher. Mm. No. That is incorrect, but yeah. You want to take a guess yourself? 
Do we want to do that? No. Wait, you what? are. Wait, what's she on now? Are they like an old artist or they like? Do they have to be? Twenty eighteen. Does top R and B mean like top new R and B or just like of all time? No, R&B? top R and B. So R&B. let's think about what Billboard is. Billboard is the charts. Who was the top selling artist? That's what yeah. I was thinking. Yeah. I don't what even remember R and B in two thousand eighteen. Do you guys have male an as well? Okay. Well, you said male R and B. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Chris Brown. <laughs> I'm gonna just say You said Chris Brown? Yeah. They wouldn't have like Chris Brown get that. To be fair, this is a hard one. It's tough. Is it like it's a ten point question. No, it's yeah. Like it's twenty eighteen as well. Mm-hmm. Like I can't even think back to Yeah, like what the hell was R and B? Like who was on top? Justin. Like, <laughs> no. 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 He's not R and B. I don't uh-huh. think you lot are gonna get this. No. 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 Pop. Okay, pop. So clearly I haven't said the right answer yet. Male R&B 2018, what songs were popular? It was like, Kehlani was popular. I'm going to go with like, um, not Daniel Caesar, right? Nope. Just tell okay. me who it was. Okay, give me, I want to guess it though. I don't have to get it right, but I do want to guess it. So just give me the first letter of their name. B. Bryson Tiller? No. Bad Bunny. Bryson Tiller, 2018. R&B, Bad Bunny? Yeah, that's... <laughs> what? But, to be fair... He's not R&B. Come who on. said Bad Bunny? Do you, do you guys want to guess? Is that... No, Bad Bunny's not the answer. No, no but what... Do you want to guess? That's with a B? Yeah. Um, Bozzy or some shit? No, no. R&B? You see, that's what's throwing everybody off. Oh, that's what's throwing everybody off. Because when I saw it, I was like, that's interesting. B. Okay, I'm just going to tell you guys. It was Bruno Mars. Oh, oh, of course it no. fucking yeah. was. That's not R&B. Listen, that's, that's talk to the award shows. Oh, talk to the award shows. I said, talk to the, <laughs> talk to the academy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> huh? It must have been 24 karat gold, I just no? know the answer. <laughs> <laughs> Was it 24 it karat gold? It's like 24 yeah. karat gold, yeah, all that of that. Was going off. Wouldn't he have done Super Bowl that time as well? Yeah. Around yeah. that, maybe, yeah. If so. it was on that supersonic time, I would have been like, yeah, that's R&B. Wait, can I know what your question was for the album? Um, how many studio albums does Pharrell have? What would it be? What would happen if I said six? You would have been wrong. <laughs> <laughs> what would have happened? <laughs> what was your question? Oh, no, my one was difficult. What was the right answer for that one? Two. What? And I was going to say six. Oh, yeah, because his actual albums. Yeah, that's oh. true. Um, my one was um, the words refer, radar, race car, or words that are the same backwards or forwards. What's the name for that in English? Oh, I wouldn't get that. Yeah. What is it? Um, like, you know when it's like race car is spelled the same forwards that it's backwards? Like What's Hannah. For and that? Oh, what is it? Yeah, radar. Refer. Yeah. Does it begin yeah. with H? No. What does it H. begin with? P. Uh, a, a pseudonym. No. Syn- no. Is, is a what is it? No, Pseudo it's something. A, it's a palindrome. Oh yeah, I was so far. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> 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 he, he tried to put the silent P on it though. Oh <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, yeah, you scored horribly. That was bad. <laughs> that was, that was bad. Okay, well, I did try to help. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's okay, you guys. Thanks for coming. Yeah. All Thanks the best. Thanks for having me. Thank you for the advice. I'm not going to do anything differently, but <laughs> yeah. I, I don't tell. know. It was a good conversation. So thank yeah. You. We'll, That's we'll keep, we'll keep up with the music. We'll have the, we'll have the journey in there. So, you know, we'll it's know how it goes. We'll know how it but goes. But yeah, thank you guys. No Thanks problem. We got so. a friend in LA, guys. Yeah. All the best. So, yeah, make sure you're <laughs> April 14. Mm. The tape is out. Sex. Other than that, you know the theory, bro. Uh, now his baby's crazy. Cool. Cool. <laughs> All right. You made it to the end of the video. I know you enjoyed this content. If you want to become a member, go and click the link in the description. Exclusive content, new content, even early release, and tickets on discount. Check it out. Become a member.